though. It's been so long. Welcome back to Smellizabeth. <clears throat> so, I'm thinking... <coughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Let me get a drink. Hello. That's a little better. Um, I'm thinking today is going to be <clears throat> a little bit shorter because it's a Thursday and I work on Thursdays. But I've wanted to stream because it's been too long and I wanted to tell my eclipse stories and my travel stories <laughs> because I had a lot of fun. It was really cool. Um, but yes, hello, welcome. Thank you all for showing up early. It's awesome. Um, and yes, fish do need water. I have not been having enough water lately. <clears throat> Hydrate. Everybody, hold on. Hydrate. Drink something right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, so... I just, I want to share some pictures and talk about some stuff, because I, I think it'll be nice. <clears throat> this is a new scene that I set up in OBS specifically for this stream, um, because rather than making a PowerPoint, I just decided to make this. 60 to 80 ounces of water a day, that's nice. That's nice. I probably don't drink that much, honestly. I need to start drinking smoothies again. Um, but yes, so... This is my, my travel story, right? This is why I haven't streamed in almost a week. So I went... Hi, welcome! Um, I went to Maine and New Hampshire and Vermont um just just new england i was in new england um and these pictures specifically the lighthouse um this is cape elizabeth which uh i affectionately have renamed because i own it legally um it is now cape smell elizabeth uh it was very nice there was uh there was a lot of wind. Um, it was it was very very cold, but it's it's amazing to me because I so I don't live anywhere near the ocean, right? Like I've been to the ocean. I could count on one hand how many times I've seen the ocean. Um, so going there was really amazing, um, especially just because it's it's my cape, it's mine. Um, and the rocks were, what is it? Stratified schist, I believe. Very cool. It looked like the whole ground was made of a bunch of old petrified trees. It, it's so cool. Um, and there were seashells everywhere. And it just, the sound, the, the beautiful sound of the water flowing. It was just so nice. Um... And I took tons of pictures, like tons of selfies that I won't be sharing because it is my face. Um, the smell of the ocean, yes. It smelled very nice. It didn't smell like ocean gunk, which has been my experience in the past with going to the ocean. Um, <coughs> but yeah, so Cape Elizabeth was super, super nice. It was, it, I was giddy. Like, I was just so excited because there is, um, there is, there's a song that I know that talks about it. And when I heard the song for the first time, I thought, oh, that's cool, Cape Elizabeth. Um, and then I, I never expected to actually go there. So it was, it was fun. It was, it was really nice. Um, and then, sorry, I have so many pictures on here in OBS. 
I can see what the selfies looked like by... Oh, that reminds me. Hold on. Uh, I forgot. There was a picture I was going to add in here that I didn't end up adding in here. Let me, uh... Let me save it really quick so I can add it when the time comes. <laughs> but yes, so I traveled through the White Mountains from New Hampshire. I traveled to the White or through the White Mountains to St. Johnsbury, Vermont. And these are the White Mountains. Gorgeous. Like I have I have literally never seen mountains like this. I live, I live in a field, right? I mean, I live in a creek, obviously, but the, the creek is surrounded by trees and then that those trees are surrounded by a field, right? Very flat land. Um, there is no elevation changes here, like none at all. But I went through gigantic mountains this weekend, or Monday? It was Monday. Um, it just, it was amazing. I've never seen a mountain that big. And like, I've been to Acadia National Park and the mountains there are not that big. The White Mountains were huge. Mount Washington was enormous. Um, and I just like, it's hard to even process when I'm going through here, right? Cause it's so big and you see them from so far away and they just don't, it just, so on the way back, I took a route to avoid traffic, right? To avoid eclipse traffic, because I mentioned in my Discord that a friend of mine was stuck in traffic for four hours, right? Which is absurd. Just absurd. Because there's so many people that went to see the eclipse. Um, she was stuck in traffic for four hours. And I took a different route and it was around Mount Washington and Mount Adam in the White Mountains. And these mountains were so big that it, three hours, right? Three hours, nonstop driving the whole time the mountains were in view. And like, like it was just driving around the mountain. It took three hours. It's just, it's, they're so enormous. Like, I, there's nothing to even compare that to where I live. It is just astounding and gorgeous. And on the way there, I got stuck in traffic. So just, like, I rolled down my window and I just smelled the mountain air. Because it just, uh, it was so nice. The whole place was so nice. Um, and I kind of had a moment where... I was just looking and you could see, I, I don't really have any good pictures of it because it was really hard to get good pictures of it. But for very brief moments while driving, you would find yourself at a higher elevation than most of the places around you. And you could look out and it was just mountains everywhere, just literally endless miles and miles of just mountain after mountain after mountain and it was so gorgeous like it it was jaw-dropping i i couldn't believe it like i said i live in somewhere that's very flat so i i can't even process it like i still can't process it it was amazing um and i just had this moment where i was like this is you know, this is what I'm here for, you know, like as a, as a person, I, I feel like to an extent that is part of my purpose is just to be able to see stuff like that and appreciate it. You know, it's just so, so pretty. You used to live in an area like really, oh my God, every town that I drove through I was so jealous. Um, malevol so, okay. <clears throat> I've never played Helldivers, but I understand Malevolon Creek because I just saw a YouTube short talking about it. So, 
an hour ago, I would not have understood that reference, but now I do. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we drove through the White Mountains, super duper nice. Um, and we, this is, oh, this is my favorite picture that I took, honestly. So this mountain we saw forever away, like so far away. I could see this mountain and I have so many pictures, dozens and dozens. I took 700 pictures, almost 800 on this trip. Um, this mountain was miles away and I could see it. And I just kept taking pictures without realizing that the road that I was on went right beneath the mountain. So I just kept getting better and better pictures. This one's, like I said, this is my favorite because the one-way sign is just cool. It just looks cool. Let me, let me move out of the way really quick. Like, it's just, here, it's just pretty, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. Um, I, like I said, I've never seen anything like this in person up until now and if like i zoom in right it's so astounding to me these all of these little dots all of these little smears are trees and i just i can't fathom it i can't it just it doesn't work in my brain every single little smudge in this picture on that slope is a tree i I, I'm sorry, I, I can't, I can't, and even up here, like at the top of the picture, those are all trees, and the back of this mountain was a ski resort, I think, <laughs> hi, um, I think the back of this mountain was a ski resort, but like, look at that, I just, I can't, I can't fathom it, I can't, it's so cool, <gasps> This is this is what happens when I leave when I leave the creek for the first time in a while. I'm just so everything is so pretty. There is so much pretty stuff out in the world and I just I love to see it even if I don't always remember all of it. That's I mean that's why I took 800 photos, right? There's so much beautiful stuff in the world. And even though I might forget it, I, I want to remember it. And I know that I took these photos and I know I was there. When you, you were the same way when you went to Florida the other week, I see marshlands easy for me. Like that is, that's normal around here. Not like extensive, but pretty normal. Um, but yeah. I like to have lots of photos because even if I don't remember being there, I know that I was there. And I know that I felt the feelings, you know? Um, that's just, that's something that's important to me. Um, but yes, so we went through the White Mountains. This was Mount Lafayette, I believe. Uh, super pretty. This, I, so on the way, I thought this was Mount Washington. Right, because it was the biggest thing around. But Mount Washington completely dwarfed all over the other mountains. Like, this this was nothing by the time I was back home. Um, so, like, I just... All of these mountains were so cool. I'll stop, I'll stop freaking out about mountains now. I think the next picture is St. Johnsbury. No, this is another mountain. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What camera is this? This is my phone. I just used my phone for this. Um, this picture, though, was on the way back. I'm pretty sure. Because this is obviously a low angle, right? You can see down at the bottom. You can see the trees. And you can see them just shrink up all the way toward the top. Um, and this was on the way back. So the sun was getting a little bit lower in the sky and all of the mountains started having shadows and it was so beautiful. I just, it's so nice. It's so pretty. Um, this is one of my favorite photos that I took 
for sure for sure um because like you can kind of get a sense of scale on it when you really look at the trees because you can see them just slowly shrink down as you reach all the way up to the top and you can't even identify individual trees anymore it's so crazy um this was mount washington or at least like the the strip of mountains that mount washington was a part of um just so enormous um see what the next one is okay so this was saint johnsbury i thought this sign was just super cool just to see there were lots of like road signs on the way there that were saying like there is a solar eclipse today no stopping on the highway unless it's an emergency which is just it's so cool because of course everybody would want to stop if they didn't realize what was happening um but yeah saint saint johnsbury is where i went and it was it was a cute little town it was it was cute it definitely did not seem to be built for the amount of traffic it had there were thousands upon thousands of people and i just it it was so cool it was just so cool um i oh okay never mind i thought i was missing something in my photos but it's just a bunch of groups now um but yeah so saint johnsbury something very notable about this town is that it had a giant church and I come from a religious place, but I am not, like, a religious person, really. Um, but I went into the church, and I asked if they had an outlet, and they did. But the outlet was in the entryway. So for, I don't even know how long, I was standing in the entryway, and there was a person that worked there, right? Um, and... He would just direct people to the bathroom because that's mostly why people would peek into the church. They would just be like, hey, do you do you have a restroom I can use? And he would say, down the stairs, cross the building, right? Simple enough. Um, but he would have to go on occasion to do some garbage or, you know, deal with something. So I would just be standing there in the entryway and everybody thought I worked there. <laughs> um... So I directed maybe 30 people, I want to say, like 30 or more people to the bathroom of this church that I had just stepped foot in for the first time. Um, hi, welcome. Um, so yeah, I just, I was standing in the entryway. I was just directing people to the bathroom. Every now and again, somebody would ask me a question about the church and I would have to be like, I wouldn't know. I don't work here. <laughs> It just, it was such a weird situation for me. Um, but yeah, so that's the story of how I randomly started working at a church. Uh, not what I expected, but I guess I, I worked off the electricity bill of me charging my phone up 40%. You know, it, it was worth it. It was really worth it because it did allow me to take pictures of the actual eclipse, which is awesome. Um, but while I was there, there were, you know, all sorts of food trucks, local businesses set up, right? And I got some maple covered cashews and maple cotton candy. And like, I like cashews. They're all right. And I've, I don't know if I've had cotton candy since I was a child. Um, but these maple covered cashews, th the flavor combination of maple and cashew is so good. Like, I was astounded. It was amazing. And it just, it was basically just cashews covered in maple syrup crust. But it was, oh my god, it was so good. And the cotton candy was literally just like maple syrup. Like, when it would get a little bit wet, it would just turn into maple syrup, which is so cool. And it tasted so good. And my blood sugar was probably like fatal 
levels. Like it was, I ate so much of that maple cotton candy. And the whole time I was walking around and I was like, hey, look at this bag of asbestos that I'm eating. Um, because it, it did kind of feel like asbestos. Um, but yeah, it was very good. It was, it was tasty asbestos. Um, I, I ate like over half the bag, probably. It was, it was delicious. Um, but yeah, so I, that was, that was pretty much the food that I had there. I think I, I did have like, like a, a, I don't want to say a bowl. It had like quinoa and fake meat because I'm a vegetarian. Um, it was, it was really good too, right? I did have like an actual meal while I was there, which is good considering it took three hours to get there. And then I was there for like four five hours and then four more hours to get home. Um, so having a meal was good because I wouldn't have eaten like the entire day if I hadn't. Um, but yeah, and they had a natural history museum there, which I just, I wanted to point this out. They just, they put stat, like they had lion statues and they just put eclipse glasses on them. And it's such a cute little thing. And it had such a small town vibe to it. I don't know. I loved it. And inside the museum, there was this monkey with a shirt on. And I took a bunch of pictures of him because he's just cool. He's just a cool guy. You know, he he's great. He's fantastic. Um, and the reason I was in the museum in the first place is because I had to go to the bathroom. Now... This was not a large town. They, they had porta potties, right? I have I, I have to sit when I pee, cause cause that's how I'm built. Um <laughs> so naturally I would prefer like an actual toilet and not a porta potty. Um So we went into the uh Natural History Museum to use the bathroom. And I was stuck in line for a single restroom for probably an hour and a half, right? That's why my phone died, or almost died. And I had to go charge it at the church. And then I ended up becoming a nun, I guess. Um, <laughs> but that's, that's why my phone was so low on charge, is because I was just sitting there in line for the bathroom in the Natural History Museum. And they they had one bathroom. Like, when I say this town wasn't equipped for this kind of traffic, there was one bathroom. Like, and I was shocked. I was shocked when I got into the bathroom because it wasn't actually that dirty, which is nice, you know. There wasn't pee everywhere, just a little bit. Uh, <laughs> the floor was a little bit sticky, but I don't have to touch the floor. Um, so I, I got through the bathroom. I actually changed in the bathroom, um, into an outfit and I will show the outfit. Um, that's the, the selfie that I've been teasing. Um, is that's, that's something I want to try to do a little bit more of. You might've seen it with the cashews. Um, but I, I got an idea for sharing pictures and I just think it's fun. Um, but I, I went to this town and I was at the church. I actually saw the solar eclipse from outside the church. So I got some cool photos. And I have only ever seen a partial solar eclipse. So when this eclipse hit totality, I, my entire brain exploded. Like, like... I got some cool pictures, right? Like, the church was really big and really old, so I got to get some really cool pictures with it. But I, I was dumbfounded. Like, I, when the eclipse hit totality, I didn't expect it to be blue, and I didn't realize I'd be looking at it with my naked eye because I couldn't see it through the eclipse glasses. It was too dark. Um, like... Traveling through the White Mountains on the way there, 
that felt very much like a natural wonder, right? Like, going through the mountains, it was gorgeous. They were just these gigantic, snowy, rocky mountains. And I felt at peace. But the solar eclipse did not feel like that. The solar eclipse felt like magic, right? Like, absolutely. This was, this is not, it does not feel natural. It feels like a magical phenomenon. Um, it just, like, my brain is not built to understand what's happening. Logically, I know the moon is, what? The moon is 400 times closer than the sun, and the sun is about 400 times larger than the moon. And I know that, but when you see the moon eclipse the sun and you see the corona of the sun, your brain doesn't think, oh, wow, this is cool that the moon is a perfect size so that we can see that. No, you think this is magic. Like you look at that and you're like, oh my God, something magical is happening because it looks like magic and it feels like magic. And leading up to it is so weird, too, because it's like, right, the amount of sun that you can see gets smaller and smaller as the eclipse approaches, right? It gets crescent. Um, so the daylight gets dimmer, but it doesn't get the color that it would get if it's sunset. Um, so it just like, it's a normal day, but it just slowly dims and that feels so weird. And then the sun also feels sharper, like, like the sunlight that you do see and feel feels sharper because it, because it kind of is, right? It's just a sliver. And I got this picture right behind me because, let me move myself. I got that picture because you can see like right to the right of my head, you can see that all of the shadows from the crescent-shaped sun as the moon transited in front of it, all of the shadows became crescent-shaped. And nobody was looking at that after the eclipse, and that made me really upset, because that's one of my favorite parts of stuff like this, is that the shadows also get eclipsed. It's so cool. Um, but yeah, it was so surreal. I have never experienced anything even near that. And I saw a partial, uh, a partial solar eclipse in 2017. So it was just absolutely astounding. And everybody, the energy in the area was so hype. Everybody was screaming and just jumping around and dancing. And it was so fun. And it was just a minute and a half of darkness in the middle of the day. Thank you for the sub. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I had an alert. Oh, I do have an alert box on here, but I forgot to raise it above all the pictures. Um, three months old pilk. Sure. Sure. I guess so. I guess I am still soaked in milk. I mean, it's been a while. The, it's probably gone now. Um, but yeah, so this eclipse was just, it was so cool. I had to share it. I just, it gets, yeah, it does. It gets really dark like it's nighttime. Um, and I don't have any pictures. You got to go to the Australian one last year. That's, see, yeah, it, it really is. It's a festival. And it's so natural too. Like, it feels so amazing. Welcome, by the way. Hi. Um, it feels so amazing because it's just like, a coincidental phenomenon, right? Just the fact that our moon is just the right size and just the right distance away, and you have to be in just the right spot, and just everybody freaks out about a shadow passing over them. And it's just, it's magic, and it feels very human, right? It feels extremely human, because it's something so special. And everybody can appreciate it because, because you can feel the difference. Like, even if you can't see it, it gets colder during an eclipse because there is no sunlight. 
So you can feel it even if you can't see it. It's just, it's so amazing. Um, and yeah, it got dark like nighttime. I wish I had a picture. I don't because I was very swept up in everything. Um, but I, well, I did try to take a picture during the partial solar eclipse and my phone kind of adjusted for it. But what you can really notice is the difference in the sky. So when you look at it, it's not like, well, I guess you, you can kind of see it in the picture on the left there. Um, the sky gets darker, right? So like you'll take a picture, your phone will adjust for exposure, but the sky is off, right? It looks off. Um, did I see much of the corona right here in the middle? Uh, let me see if I can zoom in on this. I didn't get a very high res picture because I was using my phone, but it was blue. It's so amazing. I didn't know it would be blue, but it just, it, it blew my mind. <laughs> I was, I'm the same color as the corona of the sun, apparently. You're really, yeah, I saw those pictures that you shared in my Discord. They're so good. Um, it just, it's so cool. I'm, I don't know. This is something that I'm very passionate about. I have always loved space. And to be able to see this, this is, it's like a dream come true to me. Um, and like, even after, after the solar eclipse, it felt like a dream, right? It didn't feel real because everybody was so excited. And like I said before, my brain is not made to process that. I know what's happening scientifically, but logically my brain says, oh, this is magic. That's all it is. It's just magic. It has to be magic. Look at it. You know, there, all of a sudden the sun disappeared in the middle of the day and was replaced with a blue ring of fire in the sky. Like, that's magic. You know? I don't care if there's a scientific explanation, and I don't care if I know that explanation well. It is just... It's so amazing. It's milk mat. No, dude! It doesn't have to come back to milk. Um... <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. The fish thing. I was gonna share... I was going to share the picture because this meme has been shown to me so many times since the eclipse. Um, this. <laughs> this has been shown to me so many times. <laughs> I mean, it's true, right? This is me at the eclipse for sure. Um, it's just, it's so goofy. At least the fish got to see it safely. The corona was so big it felt like CGI. Really? That's awesome. I wish I could have gotten a better picture or I wish that like, I know that some people there were talking about like closing their eyes to lower the light exposure so that when the eclipse actually hit, they could see more of the corona, right? And maybe I'll do that in 20 years when the next eclipse comes by. But this was just, it was so cool. And I'm so glad this kind man pulled me out of the water and put glasses on my face to see it. Um, but yeah, that's, that's where I've been. That's where I've been for the past week-ish. I went through beautiful mountains to see a magical solar eclipse. And I did want to share. I'm anxious about it, right? I feel like... It's fairly normal to be anxious about sharing a selfie as a VTuber, but I look stunning in this photo. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I feel like it's fairly normal to be anxious about sharing a selfie as a VTuber, but I did something to it that makes it a little bit better in my opinion. Um, so here was the fit, the solar eclipse fit. As you can see, it's very clearly me. Um... <laughs> Let's uh, get rid of these. Oops, I left Cape Elizabeth on. Um, but yeah, here we go. 
This is, uh, this is what I was wearing. Oh, okay, there we go. You're going for now? Thank you for stopping by. It's been so long. Um, but yeah, this is, this is the Eclipse fit. I didn't mean to be wearing the, jeez, why are you not working? Let me reset it. There we go. Um, I didn't mean to be wearing the same color as the Eclipse itself with my light wash you know, overalls, but here we are. Fish scales reveal. I don't think they're scales, really. I, like I said, I've got soft skin. I don't have scales, and I don't want to say that it's like a frog's skin. I would say it's more like a salamander, I guess. I think that's the best, the best analogy. Salamander skin. But I'm not a salamander. I'm a fish. Um, and I do want to share. I didn't realize I would only take about 40 minutes explaining this. So I'll probably play some Hollow Knight today. Um, I do want to share though. Like I uploaded my 800-ish pictures to Google. Just, just to back them up, right? And when I uploaded all of my trip pictures... This is the message I got. Your timeline has a few gaps. Add your missing memories now. This is a hate crime. That's a hate crime. I... You can't, you can't say that to somebody with a memory disorder, dude. That is... That's straight up offensive. <laughs> it just... It caught me off guard so hard. And I laughed so hard. Because I was like, yep. My timeline is definitely missing a lot of memories. Um, but yeah, I would have streamed yesterday. I would have talked about all of this yesterday, but I was so tired, right? Nine hours or something of travel. And it was to the point where I was so tired that my, my disorder was aggravated and I could barely remember my trip. I just needed to sleep. Um, but I slept really well last night and I rested most of the morning and then I went outside for a walk and now I'm here. Um, but yeah, so that was my trip to, let me, let me close this one off. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Um, <laughs> uh, I was gonna show off these pictures again. These ones. Um, that was my trip to St. Johnsbury, where I got to see all of the beautiful mountains and just, it was amazing. It was really, really amazing. Um, <laughs> I got to meet this monkey who I didn't realize I left this one open. Um, and I got to see Cape Elizabeth. And it just, I hope it sticks with me, you know? This is something that I want to remember for a really long time. Especially Totality, when Totality hit on the Eclipse. Oh my god, so cool. It was so cool. Um, but yeah, if you ever get the chance, if you ever get the chance to see a solar eclipse, do it. Like, put everything down, just go do it. Um, but yeah, let me... Since I didn't take very long, I have time to play some Hollow Knight. And I need to blow my nose. I swear, the faces that I pull when I blow my nose, I could never even replicate them. Um, let's switch over. I have to change my stream setting. Thanks for the awesome, thank you, thank you. I've been wanting to, I've been wanting to. Um, I've been wanting to share that because it was so amazing. Um, first playthrough. No notes, you got, yeah. Yeah, I completely understand why somebody would chase after an eclipse. It was just, 
It was a magical experience. There's no other way to describe it. It was just gorgeous. Um... But, yeah. Okay, here we go. Add back in the Hollow Knight tag. And we should be updated. Hollow Knight? Where is it? Hello? There we go. Do I look small? I feel like I look small. Um, but, yeah. Back to collecting beans. I'm gonna die a, a whole lot. Um, but, yeah, I, I want to go back. I, I want to go back. I want to go back to the mountains. I want to go see the eclipse again. Like, I, 20 years. That's my next one. Um, oh god, I don't even remember the controls of this game. Um, now I have to remember what I was doing. Let's see. I let me open my map. I can remember how to open the map, dude. <gasps> I can do the quick map. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So we've got. Ugh, my eyes are freaking out. Um, see, we didn't go to the the deep nest, right? I kind of want to go there. That sounds like fun. Sounds scary. Thanks for the diamond. Okay, so I I handed up VIP after last stream because I restricted links in my chat because of the bots. I had, I had never experienced that many bots in one stream, especially not suddenly like that. So I just, I handed out VIP to a few people who, who I think should be able to post clips if you get clips um because otherwise links are disabled um the watcher night i have no clue i don't remember um let's see what an ant one an there's there's an eclipse in antarctica next year really oh now it now I want to travel to go see them, but I don't have the money to do that. And I don't mean that in, like, the money to spare. I mean, like, I don't have money at all. Um, because, as I've mentioned, disabled, also, small-time Twitch streamer. So I have about as much money as you would expect. Um, let's see. Queen Station. I'm going to the deep nest that's my plan i have no no clue what i was doing i don't remember last stream so milk blood oh that's right i have the different spells now boom boom uh this is not where i wanted to go is it this is not where i wanted to go Wait, is there not a stag down there? There's not a stag down there. Well, time to run over to... That was close. Oh, d we, we're starting this already, huh? Um, Time to run over to the mantis... The mantis area, right? How do I... I can't even... I can't get through there. I can't even get through there. If you had money, you'd have been... Yeah, I mean, I I am very, very lucky that I have people in my life who can help me experience stuff like that. Because like I said, I don't have... I don't have resources for stuff like that. I can get through here. Was that a mask thing? I think that was a mask thing. Mask shard, yeah. I'm remembering little bits. Um, this is the hazard. This is why I stream so much, honestly. Because, like, if I don't play a game for a while, all of it's gone. All, all of it's gone. Um, except for Minecraft. 
Minecraft is special. That one's different. I always remember that game. Don't pee on me, dude. Um, but yeah, Eclipse Chasing sounds like something that would be really out. Dude, dude no, I can't die immediately. I cannot die immediately. And Pokemon, but that was short term memory. That was like really short term. But I do remember Pokemon type matchups and stuff like that really well. So I guess that is fair. Ah. Nope. Oh. My sword does so much damage now. Um, but yeah, I just, that, it was so cool. I can't get over it, right? And the more I, the more I talk about it, right? The more I am remembering, ow, um, the more I talk about it, the more I'm remembering it. Wow. wow. I forgot about this guy though. <gasps> ow. Rude. Pokemon fundamentals don't change that. Yeah. So I, I grew up playing Pokemon like a lot, like too much, probably. I mean, should have been the easiest sign that I was very neurodivergent from from birth. Um, <laughs> but I like, like I still play Pokemon Showdown, right? Like I play Pokemon Showdown a fair amount. So it's, it's pretty ingrained in me and I have constant reminders because it just, you know, Showdown helps me keep my brain going. Um, so Pokemon is something I remember. I remember types. I remember, well, I, I especially remember types, right? I've, I've got the type chart pretty much memorized. No, oh, the big guy. Boom. We're good. Owen Wilson. What would an Owen Wilson, I feel like there's a pun there, you know? A pun for an Owen Wilson mushroom. But I can't, I don't know enough mushroom species to be able to make it myself. I'm gonna sneeze again. Oh, I'm out of tissues. Oh no. Owen Morrelson? Wow. Wait, no, that wasn't a good Owen Wilson. Hold on. No, no. That's what I get for healing. I should have just left myself at low health. Okay. It begins. This is my Hollow Knight experience. Um. No, don't craygasm at that, please. Not the pilk. Disgusting. Absolutely revolting. <gasps> um. What was I saying? Owen Wilson. Wow. I can. I don't know. I don't feel like I, I have a deep enough voice to do an Owen Wilson impression. I can I can make my voice deeper, right? So I I don't think I've talked about this. I have a very wide vocal range. Um like four octaves. So I just I mean it's not in practice really. I I I haven't been practicing. Um but like I can I can hit deeper notes, not super deep, but like kind of Kind of, you know, it's no, I wasted my milk. I spilled my milk. Am I even going the right way? I am very much not. Have I, have I not been here? I don't think I've been here. Well, new exploration. You also have a four octave range. Nice. It's really uncommon and I should probably like put it into practice because like I've I've mentioned before that I've done vocal coaching for people um that is like like I said I've I've gotten a lot of practice with my voice <gasps> oh the tree uh how do I do this again nice you have to oh I have to run around and collect them nope nope 
What is this? Wanderer's journal. What is that? Oh, is it one of these? Oh, it's one of these. You use it for karaoke? I mean, any use is a good use for something like that, in my opinion. Just being able to keep it going until you find what you really want to do with it, if you want to do anything with it, it's good. And karaoke is still sharing it with people, so... I... Maybe one day I will sing on stream, but I'm not totally sure about that. Because I'm just pretty... Oh, I got them. Um, one day, that looks so weird. Um, one day I might sing on stream, but I'm pretty lacking confidence about it. Um, so maybe, maybe eventually if I get more confident with it, but it'll be cool. A channel point redeem for singing. See, I've... I've thought about something like that. I've thought about wanting to do... I've... I've wanted to do something like that at some point. It's just like... If I... Oh, really? It'll... It'll say stuff? I'm gonna have to do that next time. Up. Uh <laughs> I, no, oh, okay, we're good, um, but yeah, I'm thinking a redeem or something for singing, maybe in the future, I've considered it before, hello, bow to me, yes, um, I've considered it before, I'm just not confident about my singing, um, but, like I said, maybe one day. Wait, is that a mask shard? Let's see. Can I get over there from here? Can't. Maybe there's, like, a thing in the roof? Can I break that? No. Break that? Rude. How do I get there then? You've been you've been singing in public. Yeah, like I've never been a public singer. I've been a, a voice coach, but not a public singer. Um let's see, there's so much stuff here. And it's so dark. Oh, it's beans. Uh, what is that? <gasps> oh, that's ick. That's ick. That's ick. I... Mm, I don't like it. I don't like it. I really don't like it. Can I kill it? Kill it. Oh, no, dude. No. Mm -mm. You did an Elton John impersonation for about a thousand people? Dude, I get nervous streaming to about ten people. <gasps> That's also ick. Oh, God, this area is bad. This area is bad for me. This... Oh, uh... Go away, dude. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. What is that? Nope. Is it a... It looks like a spider. No, mm -mm. no, 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 no. Oh. No. This is the worst area. This is the worst area. 
Everything is icky. Down here. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. The worst area is Ohio. I don't... This is kind of like Ohio. <gasps> There's a door. Ow! Pogo. I'm pogoing. What is that? Oh, it's just my... I have a Pokedex? You're right. You're right. I do have a Pokedex. Ew. Ew. What is that? What was that? <gasps> Ick. Icky, dude. Icky. No. 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 I'm just gonna keep running. I don't know what's over here, but I'm gonna keep running. Ew. I... Gross. Oh, gross. You like it here? No. No. Falling into pits... Yeah, falling into pits is a lot worse here. I miss picking up the map. I don't even know if Corny can save me here. Why are there so many? Why are there so many? No. 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 I can make that, right? Yeah, we're good. Easy peasy. Um. I don't know what the point of that pit is. You disgusting creature. Perish. Uh, let's see. Where is my Pokedex? Here we go. No! Oh, oh, wait! Why are they respawning? Um. The, the Cornifer Humming Club remix. I would listen to it. I would listen to it. Um, uh, that's not it. Deep Hunter. Ew. Ew. Icky. I really don't like this place. Breakable wall, though. Discoveries. Hello? <gasps> I will rescue you from this awful place. What is that? <gasps> no, 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 no. Even the grubs are bad here. Why would they do that? Ow. Why would they do that? Grub mimic. Assumes the shape of a harmless creature to lure prey. Dude. Please be re- <gasps> Oh no. Please be real. No, dude! Why would they do this? Why? It's so repulsive. Please be real. <gasps> the real one. I have to check. Ow. Ow. Disgusting. Is the Hollow Knight a bug too? I, I thought everything was a bug. Are, are grubs tech? Grubs aren't technically bugs though, right? So I guess not everything is a bug. Ew! 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 
It is all bug. Okay. Ow. I fell into the centipede pit. The centipede. Ow. Ow. No, dude. I cannot die here. Anything here? Beans. Uh, I think this is it. Okay. So icky, dude. No. Everything is so gross here. I don't like the deep nest. No, no, no. I have to see Corny. I have to find him. No, you don't kill me, please. I can heal a little bit. I haven't hurt him at all. Right? I don't think so. That's just rude. That's just rude, dude. Hit something. Cornifer comfort us, we're scared. Yeah. I d I'm not gonna die here. I refuse. Okay. Okay, okay. Why is that me? Why is that me? What? Don't he 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 and chat at me. That why is that me? Don't not. This is because you were evil laughing at me. Now I'm eighty thousand miles away and beanless. I am beanless. This isn't even where I want to go, is it? Beanless pout, dude. I we're going to we're going to throw hands. We're we're going to fight. I can't even. Poor beanless fish. I I being beanless does make me poor. Um, can I get down there faster if I go through that other place? Through here? You know what I want to do? I want- oh. I missed him here? Wait, no, I did get a map of this. Yeah, I did get a map of this place. Um. I've- I've been wanting to make more emotes. Um. I just haven't really, I mean, obviously I haven't been home, um, which kind of makes it difficult to make emotes and I'm not going to be looking at my, my surface trying to draw something while I'm in the mountains, but, um, yeah, I'm thinking, unfortunately, that it would be a good decision to make a milk emote. <laughs> as cursed as that would be. I think it would- I think it would go over pretty well. Um... Oh, here. Okay. Am I? It's just pilk, dude! It's just endless pilk down there. Am I hearing a grub? I hear a grub. Hello? <gasps> Hello. Be free. So cute. I am soaked. I 
I jumped. I jumped. I jumped. You can't tell me I didn't jump because I jumped. Okay. Okay, we're good. What is this? Spore shroom. That looks like a charm. Is that a charm? It is a charm. Composed of living fungal matter. Scatter spores when exposed to soul. When focusing soul, emit a spore. <gasps> that sounds really cool. That sounds really cool. Stank fish. I'm not a stank fish. I may be a little bit pilky right now, but I am not a stank fish. That is a problem. That guy is a problem up there. Okay. What? What's the point of being here? There's nothing here. Hello, welcome back. <laughs> like I said, um, no. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. It doesn't even matter anymore. Doesn't even matter. No, dude. No. Oh. The fart charm is. Oh, is that what the spore charm is? It's just a fart charm. I can't die. I can't die here. I literally. It's. I'll lose all my beans. I can't lose all my beans. <gasps> Why did I do that? I am just glad that I have the grub charm. I have the grub charm, which lets me heal from taking damage. Well, it gives me soul for taking damage. I'm not going to lose my beans. I'm not. I'm going to keep them. They're mine. I just have to avoid the ravenous pisser right here. I forgot they explode. Um. Okay, where am I going? I want to go over here, I think. No pilk in my way. I need to. Excuse me. I need to get to the mantises. Please, no pilk. Okay, no pilk. We're in a pilk free zone. Now oh, there's pilk. <gasps> nice to see you, ma'am. Um. Oh, we can. Wait, we missed it. We missed the way down. There's no way. There is- I- I could not- One- I was like one pixel off. This game just soaks me in piss milk constantly. It's my life now. Don't- don't laugh at it. I should make a laugh emote. That would be good. Now that I think of it- <gasps> Okay. Heal up to four. Oh, wait. I'm back here so I can, um... I can try to talk to the tree, I guess? Proud warriors. Honor bound. Cool. I want to know more about the lore of this game. Okay. We go to the deep nest through here. I wasted my milk. The milk missile was not worth it. Here. We're here. Hello? 
Nice to see you, ma'ams. Okay. Oh, they're all back there. I didn't even notice. Disgusting, dude. We need to find Corny. That's who we're here for. We have to save him from this gross place. Ew, 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 ew. Dude, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Disgusting. I learned most of the lore while playing. Nice. I'm glad. I like that. When the lore is able to actually, like, be properly incorporated into a game. I appreciate that. Um. Oh. I was just next to him? What do you mean I was just next to him? Did I just not see? No. I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. What do you mean I was just next to him? He's hiding? Okay. I will find him. Maybe up here? Because this doesn't seem very... Hello? Corny? Hello? They trickle the lore too slowly. I can kind of see that. Because I... I want to know more, right? Like, they've got me hooked. I want to know more. I don't see him over here, though. You'll dive into Smelly's Creek and read her- Okay, I- you know, I appreciate the sentiment, but saying that you'll dive into my creek Feels like it has connotations. It it, it feels sus to me. I, mm, something feels wrong about it. You know. I break into your house. Yeah, I break into your houses. That's not sus. That's just like. That's that's just that's just breaking and entering. That's pretty normal. Okay, so if he's not there, then where would he be? Um, over here. Is he, is there somewhere that I just didn't get a map? Maybe, I didn't, I must have just not gotten a map for somewhere. Um, hmm. So I kind of want to return to the surface. What is that down there? Hi, thank you for the raid. Um, what is that though? Is that? No, it's not. It's not the what were they called? Seal? I don't remember what they were called. Um, what is it? It's not corny, right? It's not like corny's glasses. Um, I don't know. I'm I'm gonna go back to dirt now. Hello, what were you up to? What were you playing? <gasps> um, I'm gonna go back to dirt mouth. I'm gonna buy the map that I missed. I missed something. Check the shop. Yeah, yeah. That was. I I know that I missed a map somewhere. I think. Um. But oh, what was I saying? I should go and I should, there there must have been like an area that I visited that I didn't get the map for. Um, and he's just in a different area now that I, I don't know, I don't know. We'll figure it out. How did I never hit that? I've been down here so many times. Um, nope, 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 okay, <gasps> we're good. <laughs> You're playing Hollow Knight too? Nice. I just, I've, even though it's been a while since I've streamed, since I was off 
watching an eclipse. Um, I've just really been enjoying this game. He's a pro. Nice. I. I am not. I am not. Oh wait, I forgot to get my beans. Oh no, wait. I forgot to get my beans. Oh, Gigi will get my beans. You're right. Everything about this game is amazing. That's what I'm feeling. Like, my first stream of it, I immediately fell in love. Like, it's just, the aesthetic is so good and the music is so good. I am not a frog. I do keep falling in the piss milk though. That is true. Um, where am I going? I want to get to... I want to get up here. The lore is topped here. We were just talking about the lore. I, I just have to slowly learn as I go along. Because I, I don't want to spoil anything for myself. <laughs> um... I'm like one of the Zora, like a fish elf. Yes, that is that is the closest explanation that I will accept. I've I've said sea elf at least, naiad at best. Um, but typically I just stick with, hey, I'm a fish. I I was on YouTube um yesterday, and. I came across a channel, and this is no hate, right? This is absolutely no hate. I love it. Um, somebody who was like, dude, I cannot die here. Um, somebody who was like a space prisoner, but also like a fox. And like, just it was, it was a lot of stuff all together. And I love that. And I just think it's kind of funny juxtaposed with, my concept of hey i'm a fish <laughs> um oh it just got the uh, what was it essence i don't remember um oh it's been i wish i could have streamed you know i wish i could just keep that going while i was on my on my trip Hilk, no i'm not I hate that I'm at the point where I will accept being associated with piss milk and not accept being associated with being a frog. Like, how did I get here? How did I even get here? <gasps> I'm like, yes. Yes, you're allowed to say that I'm covered in, in milk, but call me a frog? Nope. Nope, that's bad. A vampire lord? See, but that's the thing. Vampire lord, that is, that's concise. You know, I like that. I, I think simple concepts done correctly are always the best, you know? Like, and that doesn't mean it has to stay simple, right? Um, like, for example, to an extent, like if I went into the full backstory surrounding my model and like the the philosophy behind it and all sorts of stuff, right? It would sound a lot more complicated than just fish. Um, but I I like things that could. Hello. Another wielding a weapon. I suppose you'll be leaving a, many a corpse in your wake. Hello. Hello. Thank you for the follow. Um, if you won't spare thought for the dead, at least consider all the extra work you force upon those in my profession. Do as you will, little wanderer. Cut a path toward your goal. I shouldn't complain. It's your kind that keeps folks like me in business. Who is he? This this gives me Dompe the Gravedigger vibes from Zelda. Um Hello. Thank you for the follow. Um 
rhino fish we don't talk about the rhinoceros model really? that's terrifying hello gg <sighs> i can see the regrets you've left behind yes yes i left my beans oh you eat the egg oh gross dude uh, you know what <sighs> you're cute and you're doing a favor, so I'm not gonna judge, but, like, it's called a rancid egg. I didn't name it that. It's just called rancid egg. I will enjoy this morsel tremendously. Now, as promised, we will begin the ritual. <gasps> That's so cute! Oh, I have to fight it! Are you good? You seem to have made peace with your regrets in a most novel and, dare I say, brutal fashion. What a joy to behold. Farewell for now. I will think of you as I savor my meal. Ew. I love Gigi. Oh my god. One fish is rancid is another bacteria's delicacy. Ick. Icky. Icky. Um, oh, this was, um, yeah, this was the, the bug that had a crush, right? Yeah. Oh, there she's on the bed. I see. Hello. <laughs> my character wears a shirt that my ears can fit through. Honestly, I've never thought of it like that. But <sighs> I do typically go, like, like... I'm making a 2.0 model. I talk about it frequently. Um, but I, I... The 2.0 model has a wide-necked shirt, too. Because um, I want the cozy vibe, and I guess that just fits. Um, wait, I can dream... Oh, that's right. I can dream nail people. I forgot about that. Boom. Wait, Wanderer, don't be shy. Cold outside, bed is soft. Uh, hello? I don't think I have to dream nail her. I think she's already nailing me in her dreams. <laughs> I don't- I don't think- She- she beat me to it, like... He gone? Did I just get rid of him? kind of bad now um my model is going to be 3d really? it is so it is this model but it's going to be just extremely updated how long i must have slept this land is so much darker now so thick with the stains of regret even the air is murkier if i sleep again will the darkness creep in here and swallow me whole that's so sad you know what, queen? Get your rancid eggs. Eat them all. Eat them all. I killed- I didn't want to kill him! You want a careless whisper sound alert? Yeah. Maybe... Okay, hear me out. Not a careless whisper one, a copyright-free saxophone one. But yes, that- that- I should set up sound alerts. The, the plug-in sound alerts. That would be nice. Um, to descend into that ruin, why? Things are so much simpler up here. I, I totally forgot about the ability to just read minds. What are you, what are you thinking? Wherever you are, whatever it is you do now, I hope you three are looking after you. Um, yeah, so I've, I've looked into Booth. The thing is, I, I've been learning to model things myself. Um, and I just like having that full control and originality. Um, I mean, look at my fish. <laughs> that's, that's my brand right there. <laughs> 
Um, and I'm not gonna find that anywhere else. So, I like to be able to, like... Okay, here's my thought process, right? I expect to be making and working on my own models for a very long time, right? If not my entire streaming career. Um, so, being able to make it myself is a really good skill, you know? Um, so, I, I like to work on it myself. I'm glad I put down my weapon. This quiet life with Corny makes me a lot happier. It would be nice to stretch my legs again, though, sometime soon. Cute. Um, so I got the deep nest map. Um, let's see. Warrior's Grave. Hot Spring. Uh, hmm. I'm just gonna head back down to the deep nest. I have it. I enter. Wait, did I enter? I can enter with the down key. I didn't realize that. I should buy everything. I'll buy everything then. I mean, I have the beans, right? The marker. I'll buy a couple. I'll buy a couple. Um, my model looks very expressive. Thank you. I mean, it's the rigging on it is mine, you know, like, especially the ears, the ears were a learning curve, but they bounce, which is my favorite part of my model. Honestly, um, <clears throat> I just, I like it. Oh yeah. You're right here. I don't have to ring the bell. Um, see i'm clearly missing a station down like over there <laughs> the bottom left and one down at the bottom um that looks cute. yeah so the ear shaking there's there's a whole emote behind it like because ever since i started streaming that's just something that i've done right it's yeah exactly it's just something that I've done. So it it just became a thing. And when I finally was able to rig my ears myself, I was really, really excited. And I made the emote. And it's it's great. It, it helps a lot, too. Because, like, my rig isn't super bouncy yet. Yet. 2.0. Um, but I... I move around a lot, right? Like, I am the bouncy person. So, went out. Ah. Ow. Dude, stop peeing on me. Stop it. You're done for, kiddo. Um, but yeah, I'm really bouncy. So, having a model that can, you know, work with that works. Because I, I move my head a lot and I bounce up and down a lot when I'm gaming. So it just, I don't know. Being a VTuber works for me for sure. Um, what is that? Wait, have I never seen that before? Charm? Hello? Ow. I'm almost dead again. Oh, that's close. That's close. I think I can make it. If I if I go like Okay. Okay, it's really close. It's really close. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Inspect. Oh, it's a wanderer's journal. I wanted a charm. I like the charms. That's like stuff like that. Like, okay, here's a great example. I've played a lot of Terraria in the past, right? It is probably one of my most played games. If I'm if I'm honest, I think it's one of my most played games. Thousands of hours. Um, and 
like the accessories in that game plus the modifiers on top of the accessories right one of my favorite things in any game because there's just so much easy customizability um and then there's vanity slots on top of it and i am addicted to character customization i mean that's part of the reason i'm a vtuber because i love character design um and my, yes i can reach it um so like terraria you'd think with so few pixels even it would be pretty limited but i i really i love it there's so many little things you can do i bet this is where corny is i bet this is where he went because i don't have a map for this place We'll have to listen for him. This place is scary, though. Am I the walking goldfish? Yes, I am. You're right. You're absolutely right. Okay, this looks like Pilk. I'm gonna test it. It's Pilk. It's Pilk. Now I'm soaked. Disgusting. Um, maybe one day I can play Terraria. Those jellyfish, though? What do you mean? What do you mean? <gasps> what was that? Why? You baited me. You baited me. Rude. That's just rude and mean. How was I supposed to know? I I feel I I feel trolled. So mean. Ow. Ah. I never maybe Maybe I never would have hit it. Maybe. You don't know. You know I have a tendency to just face tank through things sometimes. We're back on green path? Cool. I love the way everything connects in this game. Ah. <gasps> he is here. Pilk. Okay, we're gonna wait for this guy to drift down. Why does it sound like he's in the pilk? What is this? What? Well, let me see Corny. No, dude. I just want to see Corny. That's rude. I can hit the big ones in the acid so they don't explode. I'll keep that in mind for later for sure. Because I'm sure I will need the, the health from them at some point. Okay, so... I'm gonna go to the bench over here really quick to bug force field. <gasps> nope. 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 Flawless. Flawless victory. Have I been in here? I've never been in here. I, I don't think I've been here. Why is it so creepy? I hate that it's silent. That is scary. That's a spike. Where? Oh. oh. 
I ever thought about collaborating with anyone? I've considered it. Right now, I tend to just focus on single-player games, but definitely in the future. Um, I, I found a spot I'm not supposed to stand. Unless... Okay, no, I'm not supposed to stand here. Um, but yeah, eventually in the future, I definitely want to collaborate. I... I hesitate to because of because of me. Um, I've mentioned before I've got my child, can you still see? Please don't hurt me. Can't sleep with your eyes open, little one. Can't dream if you're still breathing, little one. Precious children, you speak such loathsome things as you sleep. Your claws scrape and er, your claws scratch and scrape. Precious children, a monster has come for us in the dark. Will you sing for me? No, because I need the bench. But once I get that bench, I'm gonna fight that guy. Um, but yeah, I I hesitate on collaborating because well, one, because I'm building my own, you know, my own brand in a way. Um, ow! This is bad. Um, but two, because I, I, I'm, I'm anxious, you know? Um, so bench up here. The lore behind this boss is that her children ate her eyes. What? What? Her children ate her eyes and killed her. Huh? Um, and no, I didn't know there were five endings to this game. I had no clue. I had absolutely no clue. I didn't... I, I went into this game blind. Um, I just, I just knew it looked cute. <laughs> All right, creepy place. Time to fight the murdered mother, apparently. <gasps> okay, I, I do want to finish. I want to finish what I was saying, though. Um, I... I hesitate to collaborate with people because of my my memory issues. Cuz I if something happens, it feels like it would be difficult for me to explain to somebody directly, you know? It's easier on stream when I'm talking to chat. Um but it's I feel like it would be hard if I had a moment and forgot what I was doing around somebody else. Um, let's fight the warrior dream. Whoa. Nope. Okay. Full of milk. Ow. Okay, so this isn't too bad, right? Like, until she hits a second phase and completely destroys me. Probably, you know. It's not too bad until then. Can I pogo? <gasps> I can pogo! Ow! Okay, heal up a little bit. Bop. Bop. Nope. Bop. She's cool though. The vibe is so creepy, but in the in my favorite kind of way. Ow. Okay. Over here. Ow. That was bad. She's she teleports so much though. It's like fighting an Enderman. Nope. I've got this. Bop. This is like 
it's not that it's easy, it's just not intense because she's singing, you know? It just has this weird calmness to it, despite being a boss fight. Ow. Ow. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. We're good, though. But I have no clue how much health she has. Come on. She's very tanky. Ow, ow. Bad news. Okay. Okay. She's up here. This is this is my bad. She had one hit left. It was one hit. The whole time I was like, oh, this is bad news. Oh, I gotta be careful. It was one hit. <gasps> one by one, their eyes closed at last. I felt it, a warm stillness falling over us. I'm sorry I was frightened of you. You were always protecting us, even when we couldn't see you. Take us there, please. A place where light cannot haunt us. A place without dreams, please. Face carved from stone. Oh my god, wait. Am I? The... You know, I came into this game like, this is so cute. I love it. It's got a great vibe. And then it's just like the saddest, most disturbing stuff ever. Um, I need to be right back. I, I, there's been a lot of chat messages while I was fighting the boss, but I need to blow my nose really bad, so I'll be right back. Hello. I am back. Um but yeah, I I I hesitate. I I just I hesitate about collaboration cuz you know, like like you said Meta Knight, um I would just have to explain it beforehand, uh probably the details of it. You have to go. Thank you for coming by and thank you for the raid. Um, uh, but like, I hesitate with with sharing details beforehand because it would probably be a bit more in depth than what I've said on stream. Out. Um, and like I've mentioned, I I'm a little bit still embarrassed by my disorder, so it it's hard. Um, but yeah, I, I'm definitely having a lot of fun with this game. Um, where was I going? I, oh, hey, I have 666 beans. Very, very cool. Um, I, where was I going? Um, can someone remind me? Sorry. Having a little moment. Um... I got the map, right? And then I suddenly fought a boss. Ah. Oh wait, no, I have to like milk past that. Um, 
You're taking over your Conan game? Nice. More community storytelling? That's, like, I, I think I mentioned this before when you talked about your Conan game, that the group storytelling aspect of D&D is why I like D&D, right? My DM pushes us, but it's because he rewards us heavily, too. Like, like we have some of the most disgustingly broken magic items, which is why he gives us some of the most disgustingly broken encounters to fight. Um, oh. Surprise beans. What is that sound? Is that a grub? Is that a grub? Or is it one of those little grass guys? <gasps> safety. To safety, my child. Um, it would make the most sense to collaborate with someone I already know. Yeah. I agree. Um, it's actually part of the reason I wanted to start um, using social media more is that I could make connections too, you know, and then I would be able to, can I make this? <gasps> I can make this. Um, and then I would have more chances to do stuff like that, you know? Um, what is this? Vessel? Yes. So that is, that is, it is something I've been thinking about. Um, there is, there actually, there is a streamer that I have um, exchanged out. There is a streamer I have exchanged raids with a couple of times who seems pretty chill. Maybe I'll collab someday. Dude, I'm covered in pilk. <laughs> I can't talk and pogo at the same time, apparently. Um... What is this? Though once our lands, a pale being lays claim to the caverns ahead. It may appear benevolent, but it does not share our dream. Be wary to wander that path. What is it? Wait. What? Creepy. So I see that the deep nest lead that's the fog caverns down there right that is i believe the fog caverns um and there's stuff further there's stuff further past the fog caverns because there's the the thing there weird um you know what i want to do i want to go um i can open my my inventory back up again um, I want to go here. I want to go to this right here. Because I think that would be a good place to, to figure out. And now I just have to pogo my way back without dying. Wait, I can't get back up, can I? <gasps> Dude, I just got juggled. What am I supposed to do? The map is very huge. Yeah, it is so much bigger than I expected. Um, I was able to go down here, right? Okay, this is the way. No, it's not the way. Thank you for coming by. I hope the stream goes better than it just has been for the past 10 seconds of me falling into piss milk. <laughs> I hope these little creatures don't mind me. Uh. Uh. Okay. Okay. We don't need to go that far. 
We'll just get the beans back. We're okay. Oh. Me falling into pilk is entertaining. Uh-huh. It sure seems entertaining. Dude, dude. That's your fault. That one's your fault. I blame you for that one. Got me talking about the pilk and it just draws me in. Disgusting. Ow. Nope. You, good. Accept the blame. Fish roar, dude. It's not a roar. It's, it's frustration. You know, this is a little bit of a more, my, oh, it's even more forward. Um, it's much more akin to those squeaky frogs. Oh no, dude, I squeak like a frog when it's angry. Come here. So if mine's a milk blast, what kind of blast is that? Um, but, so, this is a, this is a more serious note about, this, this is kind of what it's like for me to live my life with my disorder. Um, I was at a Chipotle and I had an episode, which it usually doesn't happen when I am out it usually doesn't happen when i am um out in public super often but at the same time i i don't go out in public a lot um but yeah i i had kind of an episode in a chipotle and because of that i was stuck thankfully i wasn't alone because i can't really be alone when i'm in places like that I... Did that guy just die too? Oh my god. Um, but yeah. I can't really be alone when I'm in like a restaurant or something. Just in case something like that happens. But I... Ha I narrowly dodged that thing. Um, I had an episode and... It was... It was rough. I, I needed to be guided, basically, taken by the arm and walked out, because I, I was just kind of stuck there, um, which sucks, uh, but it really, when I say that I am covered in pilk, I'm covered in pilk, um, when I say that I have a disability, like, that is what I mean. Right? Like, I can't go out to a restaurant and go on my own because if I forget what I'm doing or just, you know, if I just have an episode, then then it's really a bad situation for me if I'm alone. Um, but, like I s Hello? Um, like I said, I wasn't alone, so I was, I was okay. Um, this is a really bad place. But, yeah, that is like, that's what I mean. I thought that was a platform. Um, that's what I mean when I say disability. Because, like, that's just not doable. And if I tried to work a job, like a... Like a retail job, you know, I would probably get fired because chances are just the stress alone could cause me to have a moment. And then, and then I'd be the least efficient employee because I would spend a good deal of my shift completely forgetting what I was told to do and having to ask again. Um, but yeah. Blue screening in public could... Yeah. It just... The overgrown mound? That's a very, very suspicious name for a, a location. Um... 
too bad I can't be hired as an assistant. I would forget what I'm doing, probably. So, it's fair enough. Um, I get a new spell here. <gasps> I'm excited. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Milk Blast. <laughs> Um, are they just- they just keep spawning. Uh, please go away. Boom! Oh, I can't hit it because it's in the air, I guess. that uh, That's a fair, uh... That's fair. That's fair. I can't hit the flying thing with the ground slam. Um... But yeah, like... You know, an hour of of class where I teach martial arts, right? That works for me because when I'm there, I know what I'm doing, even if I forget what I'm doing. Just like, like I'm okay to go out for runs on my own um, because if I'm outside in my running clothes and I'm in the middle of running, not only does the actual act of running kind of ground me and help keep me from forgetting what I'm doing, but there it is. Um, if I do forget what I'm doing while I'm running, I'm, I'm in the middle of running. So I instantly am reminded by the fact that I am running. Tap T while holding up to unleash the wraiths. Spells will deplete soul, replenish soul by striking enemies. The wraiths? That's so sick! Wait... What is that? Milk fountain? <laughs> bah. The wraiths. That is so cool! That is awesome! I'm so glad that I found my way here. The milk splash? It is kind of a milk splash. Through here. Let's see what's over here. Um, but yeah, I can go for runs, right? Oh, is this where I came from? Um, I can I can go for a run, and that's not a problem with my memory stuff. But like, oh, oh, oh no. Um. But like restaurant, re weirdly enough, restaurants in particular, one of my worst places to be. Um, wait, can I? Ah. That's so good. That's so cool. Um, yeah, restaurants are are real bad for me. Especially, like, I have social anxiety in the first place. I had social anxiety before I... My memory issues got worse. Um, so, wait, can I kill these? I don't think I can. Um, it's the strongest one. Nice. Um, but yeah, I had social anxiety forever. Forever, basically. Um... So being in a in a position where I have to order food at a restaurant, that's stressful. And then having to remember that what I want to order in the first place, very stressful. And then I forget what I'm going to order and it just, you know, it becomes a cycle. So it said stag, right? That's what that sign was. Come on. Oh, it's Queen Station. Oh. Okay. Uh. Okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, it was you. No, not here. Wait, is she a mantis? You're not a mantis, right? Hello? The ferocious muncher. Um, but yeah, restaurants are are rough for me. 
Um, especially since I also have sensory issues. So, like, a place like, like a subway, right? That's difficult for me. But even a place that's like a sit-down kind of restaurant, that's also really hard for me because I hear all the people talking and that kind of burns my brain to a crisp. Bank my beans? You've been here long enough. You know that I'm not a bean banker. You know I keep all my beans on me. I'm all beamed up. Um... <laughs> That's the weirdest sentence I've said on stream. <laughs> Actually, you know, saying that I'm absolutely soaked in milk probably is a weirder sentence now that I think of it. Um, where was I gonna go? Was it resting grounds? Right? Yeah, resting grounds tag. It's really easy, you know, I thought I had ADHD for a long time. I wasn't formally diagnosed, but I thought that I had ADHD because of situations like what just happened, where I will be, I'll be doing something and I will forget it. You know, like I looked exactly where I needed to go and I instantly forgot it. And I have... A lot of friends with ADHD. My brothers all have ADHD. So, of course, my first assumption would be it's ADHD. But turns out it's something a lot different. Um, dead remember, penitent moth, dreams revered. This game is so cool. You have ADHD? Yeah, I... ADHD people, for me, um... Hold on. Can I upgrade? That means I needn't feel- Wait. Wait. You open the door? Nice. Um. But. Yeah. I- What was I saying? Um. ADHD. Uh, it is like- like, so many people in my life that I love have ADHD that it's just a comfort thing for me, honestly. it It's been difficult at times to adjust to talking to people without ADHD because I'm so used to it. Um, I This feels like a fight. This feels like a fight. The bugs within this glade are under my watch. Treat them with respect and you may remain, but raise your nail and you'll contend with me. I want to fight. Hi. Don't hit the ghost. But what if I want to hit the ghost? I want to hit the ghost. He is so cute. I can't. I can't. He is... Oh my god. Buy my cookie. I will buy all the cookies. Please let me. Please let me buy the cookies. Please. Beware your own mind, little one. Twisted minds breed dark deeds, and mine was more twisted than most. Though it would be my end, but I- I thought it would be my end, but instead I found this glade, and with it, a sort of peace. The only way to beat her is to absorb every soul in there and then her. I don't want to hurt the cookie guy. I used to help others. They were brought to me sick and dying. What difference did it make? Any victory against death will always be temporary. Damn. That's a doomer. Don't fear- oh. Don't- I missed the first text. My appearance should not cause you worry. Here I am truly at peace. This guy's a- a big guy. <gasps> There's so many graves here. Are you a warrior, little one? A true warrior is one who can stand strong in the midst of a storm. 
Oh my god. I w This is the one. I want to be this guy. I was once obsessed with power through my time within this glade. I was once obsessed with power, though my time within this glade has shed me of such desire. What folly it was to ever crave such a vicious thing. This place is cool. Wait, can I go here? <gasps> Secrets. Hello? That looks like a charm. King's- wait, King's Idol, what is that? It's a new thing. A white idol depicting the King of Hallow Nest. The elusive king was worshipped through these idols. Relic from Hallow Nest past, this item now holds little value except for those dedicated to the kingdom of history. Cool. This place is really cool. It's so somber. This game is so somber. amazing and this guy is so perfect <gasps> so i take it not ready to fight her she seems like too much of a girl boss for me currently in my in my current condition too much of a girl boss um where did i need to go the statue on the left Oh, wait. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. The statue on the left in You Can Dream Nail Her Head. It- Huh? <laughs> statue that I can dream nail. I've gathered that. Did I just hear something? Why do they call it oven when you of in the cold food of out hot eat the food? <laughs> Behind the waterfall? Okay. Okay. That the of in copy pasta gives me a brain aneurysm every single time. I swear. Like like, I've talked about it before that I have a stutter, or used to. It's really a lot better now. It doesn't come out very often. Um, but, like, that specific meme would, used to make me stutter every single time I saw it. So if I can dream nail the head, how would I do that? Hmm. Huh. Down here? It feels like there's something down here. But I'm swimming. No. On the statue on the left. So like, not up here, right? There's so many. Oh my God, there's so many graves. Oh, you're cool. Are you enjoying your time in our glade? Yes, I am. I'd offered advice though to have made it here. You're obviously quite adept at navigating our world and its perils. You're cool. You look sad. Don't fear my rotting form, though my body sheds and changes, my core remains the same. There's so many cool bugs here. This guy's got an eye patch. <gasps> oh my god. I'm supposed to absorb all of those to fight her? Oh, hey. Also, hi, welcome. Welcome back. Um, 
Oh, this is probably spread throughout the whole place. Yeah. Yeah, this is spread throughout the whole place. That's a hassle. I don't know if I can get all of these. I have 360 now, though. That's crazy. Oh, there's so many there. Okay, okay, we're gonna- we're gonna get them. We're gonna get them. Now I'm determined. Because if I get up here, I can get so many in a row. No, no. I missed one. I have to go back. I need to. Um, but... What were we- we were talking about ADHD, right? I missed it again. I'm not gonna get distracted by this. I'm leaving. Um... We're talking about ADHD, right? Like, so many of the people in my life have ADHD, including my siblings. So, like... I've... I've legitimately run into issues before talking to people where they felt like I was being rude and I wasn't really sure what they meant because I was just communicating the way I communicated with the people that I loved because because my friends and siblings with ADHD will interrupt you very frequently when they think of something because they're going to start thinking of something else pretty soon and forget what they were talking about. Um, the best way to get essence is the dream form of bosses. I'm not sure what that means, but it sounds cool. Um, where am I on the map? Oh, oh. Where am I? Why do I only have half of this map? Have I been here? I don't know if I've been here. ADD got bundled up into ADHD a long time ago? I didn't know that. Ow. That's it. Milk. Oh great, there's flying guys too. At least with this, I can unleash their wraiths. Boom. Nice. Ow. Oh no, I'm gonna die. No, no, dude. <laughs> Where am I? Oh, hold on. I'm getting a phone call. I'll be right back again. Sorry. Sorry. My sister-in-law came by. She needed to pick something up. Um. Up the death counter. Oh god, how many times have I died? I can do it. I can do it. Um. Add death. That's all caps. We're just gonna call it good. Add death. At least twice, right? Um. 
It's like two streams old. I thought it was up to date, kind of. I'm not the best at remembering things though, so don't take my word for it. <gasps> None of the Soul Master deaths were counted? Oh no. So we're really far behind then. I don't even know where I died. Oh, down here, that's right. Right? Well, we could figure out the death counter. <laughs> Maybe I'll go over the VOD. Ow. Ow, dude. No, no, no. Bop, bop. No one needs to know. Don't audit me over my deaths. This is where my soul is, right? Yeah. Bop. Wait, can I just like... I can just pogo them. Why did I have trouble? I can just pogo. Bop. Bop. It's so strong. That spell is crazy. Ow. Rude. Bah. Okay. And then there's another wave. Boom. Boom. Ow. Boom. Boom. Yes. Boom. It's so good. That's crazy. Out. Reported for exploits? It's literally a game function. They added it to the game. It's not an exploit. <gasps> Do I get more milk? Is that what that means? Milk upgrade. <gasps> Um, is that all? Is that all that's here? I guess so, because there's a lot more spaces here. Going from death to OP in one attempt? You're right. You're right. I'm cheating, clearly. Obviously, I couldn't have learned something. That's, that's not something I'm capable of doing. I can't learn things. Um, this is literally just a room for, for bad guys. Got it. Up here. Pro, pro, wait, uh. I, my entire brain just got stunlocked by, by messages saying preposteroni and uberlete haxor like i i i'm not processing anymore <gasps> wait no it's supposed to be pre preposterone like testosterone i see i see i see my bad you clearly clearly you can tell i am just i'm i'm teeming with testosterone obviously As, as you could imagine, right? Hello? Want a journal? I believe I sent this up, right? Yeah, okay, so we're fine. Oh, Perry. No, ew, I don't like your weird head. I don't like their weird heads. Yeah, I see. I've got a little extra thing of of soul up there. But what does it do? Oh, it's like an extra little burst. Cool. King Station? Wait, wait. Where? Hello? Cool. That's cool. I didn't realize that would exist. Um, but yeah, I just, there's so much of this game. 
Leave them alone, they're trying out bench. Hello? 300? I mean, it's worth it. Got a stag. Ding. Can I? Can I go up here? Okay, well, I can. That's all I need to know is that I could do it. You know? <laughs> now, I... It looks like there's something there. Does it not? Does it not look like there's something up there? Like, right above in the middle. I want to see. Oh, if I pogo. That's right. I can pogo the spikes. I forgot. No. Nope. I'll get it. I'll get it. I just have to be patient. Okay, patience didn't work. We're gonna spam it as fast as possible. I tried to pogo. I won't, I will. I will. No, I might not. I might not. <laughs> but we're gonna try. I shouldn't have even healed. I should have just gone and sat at the bench. Also, hi, welcome. <gasps> I've gotten distracted. Come on. Okay. One more try. One more. Okay, that one doesn't count because I didn't even hit it. One more try. Okay, that one also doesn't count because I didn't even get a wall jump. One. One. <laughs> one more good try. None of these are good tries. It was closer. It was closer. It's not a good try until I make it. No, no, no. There's not even anything up there, I'm sure. Uh, that, how do I get there? <gasps> Broken stag station. Hello? Disgusting creatures. That's cool. Ew, it's the guy with the weird hair. There is? There is? Wait. You can't... Now I have to go back. I have to do it now. Now I, I have to. <gasps> Swim past the wall in the broken stag station. I will after I this. <gasps> I didn't, I figured it just wasn't going to be possible. Nope. I've got it. Buckeye saved you and your family six years ago? Wow. A superhero. Ow, dude. Can you, can, can you save me? I'm, I'm in dire need right now. Ran straight into the fire. <gasps> Saved the dog too. Amazing. Amazing. Round of applause. <gasps> oh. Mm. I can do it. I can do this. I don't know if I can do this. Maybe I just hold jump more?
You are a dog? Yes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. I... I... Nope. 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 The answer's no. We're gonna go down to that waterfall. Okay. Swim past the wall. <gasps> There's so many... Oh! <gasps> Grubby! <gasps> Grubby! I don't even care about the suicide birds. It's a grubby. Please be nice. Okay, okay, okay. A nice grubby. Ah. Where am I? Kingdom's Edge? I don't have a map for this area. Dude. Every new place in this game just makes corny. <gasps> yes. Hello. Isn't this a cozy hole? I've been munching about that wilderness beside here and thought it for and thought a moment's break was well called for. The landscape's all rather serene in this side of the city, though the inhabitants are ferocious as ever. Yes, purchase a map. I'll keep this man in business single-handedly. Ow. Oh, there's Pilk at the bottom. I could have done better. That's, that's just a skill issue. That was just a skill issue. You have two Pomskis? <gasps> I'm a fish. I do not own any fish, though. Would that... I feel like it would be kind of morally gray. Do you... Would it be... Would it be? Um... Like, cause, cause we've talked about eating fish like that, that, oh, I hate these things. They're just, they're, these are just like hoppy little mosquitoes. Um, but like eating fish, we considered to be not morally wrong cause, because fish eat other fish. That's a normal thing. But like, would it, it feels weird if I said that I had a pet fish while also saying that I am a fish, that feels strange. That, hmm. I have a turtle. I have a bunny. Those don't feel strange. But saying I have a pet fish while being a fish just doesn't, doesn't sit right. Ow, ow. Come here. Come back here. Ow. Why are they so beefy? I have the cutest bunny ever. You are correct. You are absolutely correct. Mr. Darcy is the cutest bunny ever. He was, he was not happy with me going on a trip. I'll tell you that. He was... He was very upset that I left him. Um, he's okay now. Did I see something? Oh, just these guys. And another wall of licorice. I don't know. I don't know what that is. A force field. <laughs> Did he give me the hands? He, so the thing about Mr. Darcy, um, he, he he's very cute you can see in my about that he's he's got a very sweet face but he also gets really that was an expert move that was on purpose i killed that thing with the stalactite on purpose very clearly um mr darcy gets very very grumpy um 
like very grumpy and because of his oh, the grub grub there's a grub out because of the kind of bunny he is right he is a holland lop they have little fuzzy faces that are very very fluffy um but he just he gets this grumpy face and it looks like he's got the biggest furrowed eyebrow you've ever seen and he just looks at you like it's so cute because you can see the picture of him he is he is just the most adorable thing ever so when he tries to make an angry face it just it doesn't work for him he's just so cute ow ow no i will not be dying i will not be dying Boom. We should be good. Ow. Planning my downfall? He br <gasps> I should have looked closer at my health. <sighs> Dude. Don't clap for that. Um... Where was that? That was over here, right? Sorry for distraction. No, I stream because of the distraction. Don't hashtag pro gamer me for dying. Um, but what was I saying? Darcy, he, he is such a grump. He really is. Is that a dead body? Ew. Wait, now I'm curious. What's up here? Um, he is very grumpy. Oh, Pilk. Pilk. Um. And he, he's, he's not mad at me anymore. So that's good. He's still a little bit upset about me going for a trip. Because, so, if you don't know, bunnies pair bond. Like, they, obviously, usually with other bunnies. But... They will do it with humans, too, where they will just... They'll pick somebody and be like, Hey, you're my person now. Like, like we're inseparable. You're... You and me. You and me against the world. Right? Um, and Darcy did that with me because the day we got him was actually the day I was coming home from uh, a week-long hospital visit because I had surgery. Um... So, he... I can't die again. I can't die again. Um, just a sec. Okay, out of the woods. Um, so, he saw me. Darcy saw me when I came home from my hospital visit for the first time. And he immediately... Ew! This is the wrong way. Um... He was immediately like, this is, this, this is not a threat. This girl is not a threat. She can't take care of herself. Please, please no. Um, but yeah, so, so he decided that I was not an issue at all. And he eventually just hair bonded with me. And now he, I'm his favorite. It's very sweet. I am not his mother. Let me just get that straight. I He doesn't think I'm his mother. Um, he very much thinks he's in charge of me. Because he's, he's such a little man. It's so cute. He's just like... He's a grumpy, tiny little man. Like an old man. But yeah, he is just... something gross in my mouth um he's 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 my baby and he gets so crabby uh where oh my god i hate this area it's cool but wow is it annoying i hate the guys that shoot stuff 
Um, let's see. Where did I die? Where did I even die? Where are my beans? Um, should they not be up here? <sighs> this is a mistake. Oh, here it is. Okay. I can't heal. I just have to die again. Oh my god. I... Okay. Okay. Breathe. Ah, breathe. We're okay. It's not that far. Now we know where we're going, right? This is a pain, though. <gasps> we got it. We're not going to explode. We're going to explode a little bit, but it's okay. It's okay. Uh, it was down here, right? Yeah, down here. Take a trip to Gigi? Yeah. What's with the anime chick thing? Have you never seen a VTuber? Because <laughs> that's what I am. A VTuber. <laughs> um, it is a 3D model. Face tracked to me. Oh, they're gonna jump down here and attack me. Dude, I hate this place. I really hate this place. Oh my god. No, no. Heal up a little bit. Ow. Okay, okay. We're on three. Ow, we're on two. Okay, okay, we should get to four. No, three. We're close. Um, was it over here? I don't remember. It's up, it's up here. Okay, okay, okay. We got this. Free kill, <gasps> free beans. Um, but yeah. I've got a camera that tracks my, um, it tracks my face. I don't need to put anything on. The technology is really amazing, actually. Um, ow, dude, do not make me lose my beans. Don't make me lose my beans. Um, but yeah, it is, it's Apple AR kit. That's what I use. That's what most VTubers use. Um, and it just motion tracks my face. Bro breakable wall. <gasps> Here's the grubby. <gasps> yes. Bop, bop. <gasps> I killed it on the spikes. Um iPhone cameras can track 52 facial features that can be mapped to a model. Ask me how I know. Jeez, I wonder. Um, but yeah, so hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Now I'm going to demo this because it makes me excited. Uh, so when I started VTubing, I didn't know how precise it could be. But if you look, right? can do so much with just my face wink wonk uh right isn't that cool a lot of vtubers have toggles that can change their expressions but i really honestly just use my facial expressions dude these things are going to make me freak out They're so fast and they fly around everywhere and I'm going to die and lose all my beans.
No, please. Please, dude. I had like a thousand beans. Okay, that's actually okay. Because that just gave me... Did I just waste it? I just wasted it. How I get the anime chick? I made my 3D model myself. <laughs> I I made this model all by myself. Character design and everything. Um, and I rigged it up to be able to get tracked by the, the software. <gasps> it's really cool stuff when you really get... There go my beans! Oh my god, dude, I'm... I'm... Mmm! <laughs> my beans! <laughs> Good thing I stored them in the bank. Oh wait, I don't trust the bank. I don't trust it. I want my beans to myself. And if it, if I lose them, then it's my bad. Well, we're back in the city of tears. Um Oh, I guess we're technically in the city of tears the whole time. He can reach me? No. No, 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 no. Um, but yeah, VTubing is really fun. It's really cool. Um, and it helps people like me who have, like, body image issues, right? Because, like, it would be hard for me to have a camera on. But this way, I get to have my personality on my stream while also not dealing with, with body image problems, which is nice. <laughs> If I don't trust the bank, then convert my beans to gold and bury it under a tree. <laughs> that That is the old school way. He hits hard. Bop. Bop. Rude. Bop. Um, up here. No. Wait, wait. Is that a window? It wasn't a. Oh, it is a window. Never mind. How does one go about selling stuff? That actually is a real question. I don't know how to sell stuff. Um. Let's see. Enter. <gasps> New place. Oh, no. At least it's just the weird guys. I see you back there. Secret. <gasps> this is mean. That's mean. Oh, it's a big guy. Hello? I thought there was just a guy in the tunnel. No. At least he's kind of really bad at fighting. <gasps> He gives me 420. <laughs> All right, I guess. Oh my God, that's so many beans. I wish my other beans had lived to see this day. Unfortunate. Uh, what is that sign? Hello? I'm falling really far. <laughs> I just didn't stop falling. Like, what? <laughs> this is like back in the day, Minecraft spike drop. What is this place? <gasps> what? <laughs> oh, it's a broken elevator.
Wait. Wait, where am I? <gasps> Ew, is that more centipedes? Ew. Ew, dude. Ugh. Beans. This is kind of a rough spot, though. This was maybe not my best choice to come down here. Uh, has, uh, I don't know how to make it out of this one chat. I think I'm dead. <gasps> I'm going to be real. Unless I can get them in just the right spot. Come on. <gasps> I got one. Oh, wait. No, I didn't get one. Okay. Now I got one. We're good. We're good. Um, But, okay. So, to answer your question, if I turn around, if I just turn myself, right... There is a limit where I lose tracking. But since I have a 3D model, a lot of a lot of VTubers have 2D models. Um, but since mine is 3D, in theory, if I could keep tracking all the way around me, I would be able to fully turn around. Um, like, like this model is a uh, VRM which means it's suited for well i mean i would need some adjustments if i wanted to use it but it can work in virtual reality um which is like you know it's a cool thing um ooh, what is this what is this i mean i'll just keep following the ancient basin we found so many new places. <gasps> Corny. <gasps> yes. I'm sorry. I got too excited and I accidentally milk blasted him. Um, <laughs> I reckon not many reach these steps. We're pioneers, you and I, at least in recent history. Yes, I'll purchase a map. Map dude is your main man. Yes, he is. He is the best. Um, but yeah, no, VTuber technology is really, really cool. When I started VTubing, I didn't even realize how good it was. Like, like there's so much you can do. Uh, is that, this isn't a, a stag station, is it? Oh, it's a bench. <gasps> That's super helpful. <laughs> Goofy bench. A toll bench. Okay, I can't make it across here. Um, down at my bench. Not me milk blasting corny. I got too excited. I'm sorry. I just, I couldn't, I couldn't hold it in. I, I, not, not my fault. Not my fault. Ow, they're so hard to see. Ugh, I don't know why they growl. What is this? A true servant gives all for the kingdom. Let Hallow Nest's pale king relieve you of your burden. Drop all geo in the fountain. <gasps> I will. I need 3,000. Thank you for saving my beans. I would have spent all my beans. Let's see what's down here. Um. Hmm. This is interesting. Because I can't make this with my mantis claws. Which makes me feel like I'm going to have like a double jump it's a vessel fragment nice nice wait that's really expensive that's really expensive for a vessel fragment hello higher beings these words are for you alone our pure vessel has ascended beyond lies only the refuse and regret of its creation 
We shall enter that place no longer. What? Can I dream nail it? Nope. Can I dream nail this? No. Weird. That's another new place, I bet. See, I literally came into this today thinking that I had found most places. And I've already found multiple new places. So cool. Um, so I wanted to actually be up in the City of Tears. Because I wanted to see that area. I've got roughly half. Only half? Also, hi, welcome. Um, only half? <gasps> At least I've got Corny to help me. That's, that's my saving grace. I can pass it with an ability from Crystal Peaks. Wait, can I? I can't pogo, right? Oh. Who needs that ability? Let's, come on. I got this, right? I've got this. No! I was so close! No, dude! I was so close! No, it's okay though, because there's a bench right here. <laughs> okay. We need the bench. I got this. I, I, mm, I've got it. Nope, I've got it. I'm a pro gamer. I'm a pro gamer. I can't be stopped. See? See? God gamer. Oh, I can't get up there though, can I? Interesting. That's interesting. I want to see it again though. No, I can't get up there. Oh, it wasn't for not. It was for beans. I got beans. <gasps> I'm satisfied with that. I did it. That all I all I care about is the fact that I did it. I think that was pretty cool. <gasps> oh, milk a milk machine. Um, we have to make our way back up. All of this looks like broken elevators, honestly. We need to get out. Hello? Where am I? Oh. Oh, I didn't really explore down here, did I? There's so much. Ew. You're the spit guy, right? Yeah, you're the spit guy. Boom. Yes. Should be a mask shard? Nice, okay. What was that? <gasps> Hello? Ew. Jelly bubbles. Oh, I see. I see. I see the issue here. I see the issue here. Boom. Out. Boom. Out. Okay. Well, at least we bought the bench. <laughs> There's so much stuff down here. In time. In time, I find it all. Get some milk back. Ow. Ow. At least we got the milk machine. Um, up here, right? Up here and to the left, I think. To the left? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 
Cloth is there to save me? Really? Cloth was cool. I've only run into cloth once. Um, was it over here? I was over here, right? Yeah. Ow. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we got this, right? Right? We got this? Right? Right? Are we stuck? Wait, dude, they're just closing in. Ow. Okay, that guy's dead. Boom. There we go. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. <gasps> Hello? Pale ore. Let me look. Rare pale metal that emanates an icy chill. Prized by those who craft weapons. Oh, I'm I'm here to save cloth. Oh, that's what the squeaking was. I don't know if I can even bite this guy down here. Okay, 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 okay. Get a little health. Okay, a little bit more health. Just a little bit at a time, you know? Hail ores used to upgrade my nail. Nice. Ow. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Ah. I don't like the way they jiggle. Nope. Oh, quick dodge. Okay, that one I kind of jumped into, but we tried. They're so gross. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to just make it out. No, dude. So close. There were so many good dodges there. Ow. I had no opportunities to stop and heal, but there were so many good dodges. Oh, I should make an 07 emote, too. That would be fun. Especially with how much I die. Okay, run this way. Right over up here? Yes. Nope. Oh, up here. Okay. Ow. Ow, dude. They're so aggressive. I hate the little spitty flying guys. Where does that come from? How am I supposed to fight this? Okay, at least they crossed. Ow. Boom. Boom. Okay. Okay, okay, we're okay. What am I hearing? We can't die here. We can't die here. Oh, it's my soul. You're right, you're right, it's my soul. Boom. Such a fun spell. <gasps> oh, hello. <gasps> Hold on. I have a soul to find. It sounds like it's right here. I don't hear it. Oh, it is down here. Weird. Thank you for the help. Uh, how did I get back up? Oh, I have to go all the way around, don't I? We're fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. See, there's no issues here. Everything's fine. Oh 
my god. You asking that question reminds me. I forgot to pin the question of the day. I gotta get back into practice. My friend, you dealt with all those beasts? I'm ashamed to say I was hiding. Those ghastly things chased me and I ran. If you hadn't come along, who knows if I'd ever have survived. Others take me for a fearsome warrior. What with my impressive size, but this kingdom's beasts, I wonder if I'm just no match for them. Enough! I cannot wallow in my weakness. I must take strength from your example. I love her. You act so confident in battle. You show no fear before your foes. I'll try to make my best to do the same. I love her. I look forward to our next contact, tiny savior. Then you'll meet a warrior with courage to match your own. Oh, I love her. Uh, welcome back for dinner. Um, I, so I don't actually watch a lot of movies personally. Um, I feel like, I don't know, movie culture just isn't something that really, I'm going to die again, aren't I? Um, movies, not, not totally for me. I have trouble with them because just... I mean, generally, if they're a long movie, I'll end up forgetting most of what happens in them, um, which is just an unfortunate part of my life. Uh, but, you know, I still get to enjoy games when I stream them. So <laughs> if I could stream movies, maybe I would do that. But I think that is probably illegal. Um if not definitely illegal. So I need like a, some kind of pass for that. I assume I, if I get whatever this pass is, I will be able to go, yeah, through there, like through the top there, across to the deep nest from King's, Kingdom's Edge. Um, hmm. but yeah. Um, hi, welcome. Um, but yeah, no, like, longer movies, um, the passes in Deep Nest, ooh, good to know, good to know, good to know. Um, longer movies, I, like I've said, um, I don't, I have issues remembering things, so even if they do their job well and it's a good movie and it's not forgettable, I'll still probably end up forgetting it. And that's nobody's bad. Um, Pantheon. See, yeah, I don't know what that means. And I'm kind of scared. Um, you know what I am expecting eventually? No, 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 no. Um, I'm expecting spiders. Um and i for those of you who are new i don't like spiders um in fact i am very much scared of spiders so i i was told at some point that there are spiders in this game so that's gonna be rough <laughs> that's gonna that's gonna definitely be a stream for sure um the Pantheon is something I shouldn't worry about until I've beaten the boss at least once. <gasps> okay. I'll try. I'll not worry about it. I'll try. I'll try. The final, the final boss? Okay. Oh, is this like... <gasps> My brother talked to me about this game before I started playing it. And he talked about how he went for like 112%. Is that what you mean? Because <gasps> that feels like... A 112% kind of thing. Something that you wouldn't worry about until you've beaten the final boss at least once. Oh, I have to get in there? I can do this. No. Close, though. Okay. That was my bad. Get some beans. 
How do I? Oh, okay. That works. I'll take it. Up here. Report it. You can't report me for exploits for playing the game. Do I read books? Similarly to movies, books are hard for me. Um. Ow. I don't need those beans. Um. Because, like I said, I will forget. Even if it's good. Even if I'm really enjoying it, I'll forget. I've... If I'm being totally honest, I've already forgotten a chunk of this game. Um, but that is just the burden I live with. Um, can I get over here? Yes, yes. I should not have blind faith in this game. No, I don't. After all of the weird little tricks that they've played on me, I, I, I don't. I don't trust this game, but I don't trust it in like the best way. You know, does that make sense? It's so, it's not a matter of training my memory. I, I have a disorder um, and I will, I, I wish I could train my memory. Um, oh no, dude, I fell so far. Um. I, I wish I could train my memory, um, but it's, I lost a jump king, basically. Um, yeah, it's kind of, it's something that's pretty out of my control, unfortunately. Um, streaming helps me, which is part of the reason I do stream. Um, You were gonna ask what part you forgot or what part I forgot? Yeah, that would be a difficult question to answer. <laughs> um, hello, you. You know what I want to do? I want to go there, up at the top. I want to go there. But yeah. I just, I, I have doctors, you know, I'm, I'm getting a specialist. I can get there with a simple skip, but I don't want to skip things. I want to do things the right way. Um, this area feels suspicious though. Oh, do I want to visit? Uh, I don't know. I don't, oh god, hello. Ow. I don't know what I want to do. I'm just going around. Crystal Peaks? Okay. Okay. I got it. Yes. Crystal Peaks. Crystal Peaks it is. That's right, you mentioned that, didn't you? Ba ba. Boom. Milk Blast. <laughs> Boom. Bop, bop, boom. Boom. He's so tanky, dude. Bop. Just out of range. Ow, that was not out of range. Bop. Please, no. Okay, we're just gonna, we're gonna leave him be. He's gonna kill me. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna go back to our bench, I think. We're gonna find where our bench was. This is the broken stag stop. Um. I just wanted to kill him for some beans, but it didn't work out. Didn't I want to go through this broken stop? Did I? I don't remember. Okay, healed up, saved, all of that, uh, and we wanted to go to the Crystal Peaks, right? Or whatever it was called. 
Yes. Oh, I didn't. I didn't even realize that I didn't talk to him. Um, let me look at my map first. Oh, where was that place? Oh no, where was it? I don't remember where it was. Um, was it there? I feel like it was here, because I've been there. I have been there. Um, so I like I do know what it is. Northeast. Okay, yeah. So it is Northeast Forgotten Crossroads. Okay. Should be easy enough then. Uh, we should be good. Everything here is so weak now. Yeah, Crystal Peak. Up and up and up and up. Oop. Through here. Just keep dashing. What inspired me to try out this game? So, I... I play a lot of Zelda. Um, I've played a lot of Zelda on my stream. And this game... Don't say milk. Ew, dude, don't say that. Um, this game gave me a similar vibe. Um, just like the little guy with the sword. It looked cute. It, it had a good vibe to it. Um, and I was in the mood for something a bit more difficult than a Zelda game, that's for sure. And I knew that this game was supposed to be relatively difficult. Um, so I, I tried it out. Um, you have food trucks outside your store and you're messing up some cheese curds. Nice. This game first time is very hard. I've noticed. I've definitely noticed. It has been a learning curve. Um, but I'm really, really enjoying it. Like, I, I'm really liking it. Um, I, I didn't know what to expect, right? I didn't expect to love it instantly. That was, that was a surprise. Um, but I, I really, really like it. Nope. Bah. Okay. Uh, kind of, we're kind of good. Boom. Boom. Um, okay. Wait, I missed a bench, didn't I? I feel like I missed a bench back there. Ooh. Ooh. Around him. Okay, back through here. Over here. Oh, oh, what is that? No, no! Ah, oh, dude. I can smash, oh, I can, okay. That makes it so much better if I can smash those crystal formations. That sounds really good for me because I have trouble with those. Wait, can I, <gasps> did I just pogo and change it? I just pogoed and flipped it. <gasps> yes, and it's a rancid egg. You know what, that'll help because I've been dying a lot. That'll help, because I die. I die frequently. Bench. There we go. Um, bop. Let's see. Oh, that makes this area so much easier to deal with. I can hit the crystals back up. No way. I want to try that. Oh! <gasps> That's so cool. That's so cool. Did I just, I think I got hit by that one and deflected it too. That's weird. That's such a cool mechanic. I didn't even realize. Ow. Actually, you know what? That was a pro gamer move. I just bounced off of it. Souls games. That's another thing that I want to play eventually. I've never played a Souls game. Um, I'm actually... Ow. Um, 
Okay, that was just rude. Um, I, I'm surprised that I didn't play Elden Ring before this. Because I've had that downloaded for quite a while. Boom. Boom. Okay, good. Let me get there. No. No. Um, let me look at my map. Oh, uh, dude. This is not where I wanted to be. All right. I'm going to take the stag. This is not the stag. I thought there was a stag. Stag is all the way over there. Um, it forces you- Yeah, so that is something that I've been a little bit- I'm back and forth on games like that, right? Games where you have to die a lot to really learn how to play it. Um, cause I don't know. I hesitate. I hesitate. Um, but I've also mentioned in the past, like I get good. Sorry, my bad. I should just get good. I should, I should just get good. Um, I used to play a lot of Terraria, and I really, really liked it. Um, and I played on, like, really hard difficulties on, you know, suboptimal classes, and I would... I would beat the game. Like, I beat Master Mode for the Worthy. Um, and that was the closest to a Souls game I've probably gotten, honestly. Uh, Fargo plus Calamity. I've actually not not played through Calamity yet. Um, I really want to. Like, I think at one point I got decently far, but I've never fully beaten the Calamity mod for Terraria. It, I love it. I love the whole vibe of the the mod, but I've just never been able to complete a playthrough. The air fryer is a monstrosity. Careful. <gasps> Calamity on its own is not too bad. Did- Does Fargo mess with Calamity? I didn't know that. Um. I- I- Yeah, I do think maybe- Maybe one day I could stream Terraria. <gasps> that would be fun. Um, I- The movement in that- See- that's the thing. This game, obviously, obviously I'm new to it, right? This is my first playthrough. But Terraria, I mentioned earlier, I have well over 2,000 hours in Terraria. So my movement in that game is nuts. Like, I am all over the place. It is awesome. Your wife likes an air fryer. <laughs> um, but yeah, maybe one day. That that can go on the list, I guess, of games to play on stream. I have way too many. Um, no, this is not the way I want to go, right? Hmm. Calamity is big on dodging. Yeah, and oh, grub. Oh, wait, I want him. Ow. Ooh, the pogo. Um, like, Calamity helped me with uh, Empress of Light in, like, the hardest difficulty in Terraria. Because I just, I just learned those dodging skills. And that, honestly, that game taught me 
how to recognize my patterns. Thank you so much for the sub. Um, that game taught me how to recognize patterns in bosses, right? Because I remember being young, like young, young, playing Terraria. And I, if I can do Empress during the day, yeah, that's what it was. I did Empress during the day. Um, and that was like my biggest accomplishment. I did Empress, Empress of Light during the daytime, master mode for the worthy using whips as summoner. That is my biggest gaming accomplishment probably. Um, it was, it was very difficult. Ow, dude, why are they just, these guys are just hammer bros. Um, but yeah, that was that was something I I put so much practice in. Those are definitely all words. <laughs> they are definitely all words, all of them. I remember the first time I like really stopped and recognized like, wow, I am a nerd. Desert rain frog. Come on, dude. <gasps> Always gifting subs to weird cursed people. Um, but Terraria was the first time I really stopped and recognized like, wow, I am a nerd because I sat there and I was thinking to myself like, you know, I really want this blizzard staff for my mage loadout, but I have to beat the ice queen during the frost moon. And like, <laughs> if that's not a nerdy thing to say, I don't know what is. Hello, grubby. Like that, it doesn't get nerdier than that. I didn't squeak, I didn't squeak. Also, these things are terrifying. I did not squeak. Ow. I don't believe you that I squeaked. I didn't hear it. Cat has been hunting for your garden frog for days. Good thing I am not a frog. Uh, this... That really is an insta-kill, huh? Squeaking occurred? I don't believe you. I got this. I got you, Grubby. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay. This is, this is close. Your best gaming achievement is beating a very special boss in this game. Ooh. Okay. Exciting. Grubby. <gasps> We've gotten so many grubs today. Open up. That was a lot. Oh, it turned off the things. <gasps> cool. It took you 16 hours to do it. Oh no, dude. Why would you tell me about this? Because now once I figure it out, I'm going to want to do it. And I'm gonna have to grind it. I have to. That's just the kind of player I am in games like this. Okay, heal up from the milk machine. Oh my god. It fired so many crystals at me. Oh, there's two, that's why. Uh, uh-oh. 550 to 600 hours that's that is you can't say that's not very much 600 hours is a lot um is this where i want to be i think this is where i want to be oh i like this guy he's cute that guy's cute um and don't don't make the don't make the soul thing weird. Ow. Boom. 
Boom. Don't make this whole thing weird. So, the game that I have the most time in... You should know this. I mean, obviously, you know me. Sierra knows me in person. Um, ow. Um, Minecraft. Yeah, yeah, Minecraft. Minecraft is absolutely same. I totally mistimed that. Okay. We can get through this. Oh, that's, that's rough. Um, but yeah, I actually, I have an old Minecraft world. Not old, old. Like, like very well played on Minecraft world. What do you mean that crushes me? Hmm. We can heal a little bit. Okay. That was dumb. Oh, and I'm back at the beginning. Um. But yeah, I've I've played so much Minecraft. Come on. I actually started out as a Minecraft streamer. There we go. Um, Minecraft was the first game that I that I streamed. <gasps> Grubby. Yes, we saved another one. That's so many. Mineplex. I played on Mineplex as a kid. I used to play um. Okay, as cursed as it is, I used to play uh, the Counter Strike game that they had on there. Um, what was it? Mind Strike, probably, right? That was the name. Um, that was my introduction to first person shooters in a weird backwards way. Um, which is funny considering I went on to play one professionally. Ow. Um, oh, we're dead. No, dude. No. We're all the way back here. Top 100 in, in Mind Strike? <gasps> That's dedication. That's dedication. Uh, let's see. All the way up here, right? No, no, wizards? Oh, I don't... <gasps> Aforementioned memory issues? I All I remember is the name Mind Strike. I don't know anything about Counter-Strike, and I didn't know if they washed it clean with Minecraft branding and called some things wizards in the game. <gasps> I don't remember that game at all, though. Hmm. It wasn't widely known. Oh, I'm sorry. That That's always heartbreaking when you love something so much, but it just doesn't have enough traction for it to continue, you know? Um, there's, it's just, it's just a bad feeling, you know? Um, where you just like, and it's good, right? It's something good too. Something that you really like because it's just genuinely good in your opinion, but not enough people like it. Then they moved it to the back of the lobby. Oh, that sucks. So it was them then. The ow. Um, are you gonna attack me? I thought that guy was attacking. You turn around. Okay, never mind. You don't have to turn around. Ow. Ow. Fine, I'll fight you. I'll fight you then. Fine. Fine. <laughs> Super Smash mobs. I've never heard of that. <gasps> I used to want to get into Smash Bros. Um, like, like when I was younger. I really, I wanted to be good at Smash Bros. 
Um, cause like, I'll admit, I'll admit the reasons behind it. I had heard so many stories about Smash tournaments being absolutely plagued with like gross dudes that hate women and like, like the actively sexist kind. Um, and I thought with my professional gaming experience that one, I could get really good at Smash Bros. Wait, that's paper. Is Corny over here? Corny. <gasps> Corny. Wait, I don't have beans. <gasps> no. Uh, but yeah, exactly. I wanted to be a Smash player because I wanted to go and like for those of you who saw the picture that I I showed earlier in my stream like that kind of outfit, you know the the overalls with the pink shirt underneath That is very me. That is very much stuff that I wear um, And I just think it would be kind of funny if I went to a Smash tournament. Is this a... Hello? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um... I just thought it would be kind of funny if I would go to, like, Smash tournaments and just be my very, very girly self in person. And then all of the dudes that hate women there would be very upset at that. Ow. Oh, he is pretty easy. There he goes. Give me this bench. Yes. Um, the guys you knew. Oh, very, yeah. So. I mentioned I used to play a game professionally. Um, I played Overwatch. And the thing about that is I, I had an account with my name on it. Um, and, you know, people would see my name and they would just be rude to me because they'd, they'd be like, ha, oh, girl, a girl, you, you girl, and I. My way of dealing with that. Yeah, they would immediately go, "Woman, she must be bad." Um. I my way of dealing with that was by simply being better. I have enough. Oh, thank you, thank you so much for reminding me. Ow, I need to not lose my beans. Um, but yeah, my way of dealing with it was just by being better than them. Genuinely. That was my, my mechanism for dealing with the sexism. Yes, by the map. Yes. Okay. And I have to get, yeah, okay, yes, 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 yes. Um, you're a girl, play Mercy and Heal Me. See, that's the thing. I was a support player. But I also, um, so for a brief period when I, that was dumb of me, um, for a brief period when I was, uh, trying to get really good at Overwatch or while well, I, it was while I was playing Overwatch professionally, um, I was also grinding Apex Legends and I played with some pro players like privately at some point. Um, and, oh wait, this is a safe place now. Okay, this is a safe place now. Um, I can kill the laser guys with spells. Okay, good. Um, but yeah, so I was grinding Apex Legends at the same time as I was grinding Overwatch, which is just a, a way of saying that my aim was really, really good. And nobody expected that out of out of the Mercy main with an account named Ellie, you know? So 
if I was playing something that wasn't Mercy, like Lucia was my character, um, nobody expected me to absolutely demolish them. And I did. I did. I'm still proud of that, honestly. Not as proud as I am of, like, uh, the Terraria stuff, but it it did give me some satisfaction to to put put people in their place who are being sexist you know and i think that's a fair a fair thing to feel satisfied about <gasps> um okay so we need to go get the bench and we're going to look at our map where do we want to go up i think up Wait, I can't go over here, right? I don't think I can go over here. Um, and I think... You just let people buy you houses because you're a girl. I can't... I can't fault you for it if they're gonna do it. Um, I must keep going higher. Got it. Um, I think that's kind of a theme that has just kind of stuck in my life. Because, like, like, I do martial arts. I do martial arts now. So, shopkeeper's key. What is that for? Um. Ow. But, like, I do martial arts now. And I talk to... S oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll talk to Sly. Um... I, I, not, I don't just do martial arts. I'm an, I'm a martial arts instructor. Um, and the type that I do is, it doesn't take strength. So, like, lots of people, hello. 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 <laughs> Good timing. Thank you for the follow. Ah, uh, quite a view, no? I'm not surprised you survived the trek through these shimmering caverns. There's an air of strength about you. I suspect it would be quite intimidating if not for your small stature. <laughs> That's so cute. That's literally a perfect segue back into what I was talking about. I wear a pink scrunchie all day. Like, like pink scrunchie is what I am as a person. I am, I am a fish girl VTuber. Like, there is nothing intimidating or imposing about me in real life. Like, I just, that is, I've accepted that. But at the same time, I also know how to break an arm in about 60 different ways. So I'm, I'm okay with not being intimidating because because if somebody does underestimate me or think that they wait that was a cracking cracking floor <gasps> no i don't have a i don't have a slam wait i need soul i need soul really badly can't get not i cannot get it there that's an egg oh, i can't get the egg either um but yeah so People, especially where I live, especially where I live, people see me and look down on me, not just height-wise. Um, although I'm not that short. <gasps> That's so cool! Ow. Um. But, yeah, so it's, it's nice to know martial arts in the least... Just because if I go out for, like, a run, if somebody wanted to stop me, I I would put a stop to them. You know? Rancid egg. Is there not a switch here, though? Hate when people judge someone based on... Yeah. Like, I... I've gotten a lot of looks. That's for sure. Um, because people, people look at me like, like I'm, I mean, I am a small woman, but 
they look at me like I'm a small woman in a negative way, right? They treat that as a bad thing. Um, and I don't think it's a bad thing at all. I'm very glad to be a small woman, and I think that the issues that I've faced for being a small woman are not at fault. Like, being a woman is not at fault. What's at fault is the people who treat it poorly. Um, which is why I know how to break arms in many, many ways. <laughs> It's just, it's one of those things that I've had out, I've had to work through as a person. Uh, oh, it's a blockade. Uh, can I break these? I don't think I can even reach that. Okay, I might have, to, oh, never mind. Never mind. This is quite the gauntlet. This must be. My bad. This must be where the item is, right? Ow. But yeah, I actually. I have. No, dude. Um. I actually. I mentioned earlier that I have to work tonight. That is, that is the work that I do. I, I beat people up. That's, that's what I always say my job is. Cause I teach martial arts. Sorry, concentrating really quick. Um, I, I, I teach the martial arts cause I got so good at it. And since it's muscle memory, I don't have an issue remembering things, which is really, really special to me. Violence for fun and profit? Exactly, exactly. The music stopped. What is this? I shouldn't have hit it. I didn't mean to hit it. Oh. Crystal heart. While on the ground and clinging to a wall, hold Q. Release the button to blast. Oh, that's cool. What kind of martial arts? I do combat hot keto. So it's a very, um, it's a very no nonsense martial art. Um, hold Q to super dash. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. I love it. That is so cool. Um, yes, no nonsense. It's a no nonsense martial art. That's not a weird thing to say. And it holds me on the wall. That's so cool. Um, combat hot keto is like, it is very effective. It is very effective. Rubby. What is a what is a nonsense martial art? I don't want to say taekwondo. But nothing else comes to mind. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's the truth. It's the truth. Taekwondo is just it's very flourishy. There's just a lot of a lot to it. You know, a lot of moving, a lot of twirling and spinning and all of that. Um, Combat Hop Keto is very much like, like you grab my wrist, your wrist is now broken. Like it's simple as that. Very, very easy. Kung Fu, Tai Chi. I don't, I don't know if Tai Chi is considered a martial art. I guess I'm, I'm not really an expert on that. Um, and I also don't know much about Kung Fu either. I just, so the dojang where I practice is, um, it's, it's a Taekwondo place, right? Cause Kamat Hapkido and Taekwondo are both Korean martial arts. So I, 
I'm exposed to Taekwondo a lot when I'm working. And like, like the people that I work with, um, a lot of them have done Taekwondo. That wall, I'm going back, there's a wall. Um, I'm looking for a wall. Wait, can I? Nope. Ah. Oh, yes. Okay. Back where the minor guy was? Okay. 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 Um, but yeah. Ow, dude. I hate these things. Um, yeah. I, I'm exposed to a lot of Taekwondo. It's a Korean martial art, just like Hamad Hapkido is. So I feel safe to say that it is a little bit goofy sometimes. <laughs> Where am I going? I don't even know where I'm going anymore. Hold on. Where was the minor guy? I need a reminder. Horny's gone. Wait, I can't make it up there, right? No, I can't. Can I? Boom. <gasps> That's the way out? Oh. Oh, I'm still going. <gasps> Whoa. <gasps> I'll have to go back down to the dark. Oh, I don't remember my way back down there. I'm going to find my way out first. I can come back later. Mm -hmm. We'll see it in the future. You just got your purple belt? Nice. I think, was it purple that, oh, I just canceled my dash. <gasps> I didn't know I could do that. <gasps> cool. Um, elevator. Um, I think my student just got a purple belt. Is this where I think it is? Is this Gigi? Really? <gasps> It is. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. That's so nice. Wait, 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 wait. I want to fly across the, the sky here. Can I do that? It took you almost 10 years to get a purple belt. It feels like it's going to take me 10 years to get my black belt. I want to see. Where do I end up? What? Hello? I'm back here? <gasps> Whoa. I didn't realize I could even get back here. <gasps> I can collect more beans. <gasps> Not a lot of beans, granted. There's things I can do here now. You know what I do want to do? Oh, hey. I'll take that. Bop. Um. How do I spell the martial art? Here, I'll type it out. I'll type it out in chat. Combat Hapkido. Like I said, it's a Korean martial art. Very good. Um, very, very good martial art. I love it. It... Like I've mentioned, um... Just, like, repetitive motions. Um. Oh. One. Dude, dude, let me go. Um. The repetitive motion of it is really, really good for me, right? Because it helps keep me here. Um. I don't know what's in this place. Um. It, it helps keep my memory good. Um, and, like I mentioned, muscle memory. Um, I, I need, I need muscle memory to remember things. <laughs> instead of relying on normal memory, which I have very little of. Um, there's a secret in the first room. Was this the first room? Ah, this is the first room. Beans. 
I like the the juxtaposition of I won't say where unless you want me to and go past the wall. <laughs> it just quite the combination. Ah. Well, we're up here now. I appreciate I appreciate the not spoiling. I I always appreciate that. Have I ever been- oh, oops. Have I ever been here? Howling Cliffs. I've never been here. I like this. I- Where am I? What is this? <gasps> I just flew my way back home? Or I guess this isn't my home, is it? That's not what I expected. Um, Kings Pass. I can't see up there, though, because I don't have a map. There's a fun guy I can find there. I want to go there. But I also... <sighs> Okay, is there a boss that I can fight right now? That's what I need to ask. It, oops. Is there a boss I can fight right now? Because I have to work. I have to go to work soon. There's a, quite a few. Okay, 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 okay. Where? Where do I go? Lead me to get my butt kicked. Basin. I don't know where the basin is. Ancient Basin, down here. I don't have a, uh, a guy, though. A stag. If I, okay, I'll go back there, then. Boom. I love this ability. It's so cool. Boom. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're just going. Okay, so we need to get to the first room. That's not where I wanted to go. There's also a crossroads boss, really? I missed that? Um, this is also not where I want to be. Oh, I need to go further down. I see. I see. I've heard tales of the mender bug and I feel like it's fake. Everything I've heard about it just doesn't sound real to me. Okay, let's go up here to the left. It's the rarest mob. I will choose to believe it because it sounds cute. It sounds cute. Howling Cliffs. This is so cool. Ow. Rude. Um. Oh. Hello. It's a bench. There's so much. Hello? <laughs> Nail Master Motto. Ah, well met. Yes, I thought I could sense the aura of a fierce warrior approaching. I'm impressed you found my sanctuary here at the top of the world. No doubt you've endured many trials and overcome many foes in your quest to find me. No, don't speak a word. I, Nail Master Motto, who is taught the art of the nail by the great Nail Saga himself, hereby accept you as my pupil. Okay. I guess this is how we're ending things. We'll learn from the nail. Oh, God. Whoa.
Hold left mouse button to concentrate energy into the nail. Nail is so mid. <laughs> nail sage. I knew you'd comment on that. <laughs> now I know how my own master felt when he passed down his teachings to us. <laughs> I just met this man and he's like, you're my child now. Oh my god, I like him. Finish. I'm actually gonna go do this at martial arts. Okay, let's see. It was hold left click. Right? Finish. There are two other guys to learn from. Nice. Okay, maybe we do go beat up the ghost. It said... I thought it said hold. <gasps> That's so cool! Boom. I love it. Dude, you don't know what's about to hit you. I am Gorb. Bow, 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 bow to Gorb. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't expect that. Ascend, 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 ascend with Gorb. Challenge, yep. Sure. <gasps> so this is Gorb. <laughs> is what me, the squeaking? I know I squeaked. It happens. Ow. Everybody's always commenting on the squeaking. I can't help it. Gorb kind of looks like a fish. He kind of does. He's very wormy. Wait, can I? Bah. Okay. Why would I want to help it? Because it's... It, I feel self-conscious. <gasps> Boom! That was good damage. Wait, I'm almost dead. Wait. Gorb, don't be- don't be like this. Ow! Gorb? Gorb. No, Gorb. Bad Gorb. No, Gorb. Gorb is easy, but so annoying. I'm feeling that. I'm definitely feeling that. Okay. Bye-bye, Gorb. Ugh, my eye itches. We've done it. I am Gorb. <laughs> The great mind, the paint. Oh, okay, that's a little less funny. Ascend, I am Gorb. Goodbye, Gorb. That's a lot of essence. 100. Marmu is the most annoying boss. Interesting. I'll... I'll try to remember that. <laughs> Maybe I'll remember it. We'll hope. Um, let's go find a bench. Uh, do I have... Nope, I can't see anything up here. Oh, I just left a marker. We can go back to Dirtmouth. There's a bet. Oh, there's a bench by Mato? Okay. Uh, now I have to find where he was. Is he down here? He wasn't down here. He wasn't down here. We'll find it. I can't believe... At least, at least you didn't clip it this time. That's all I have to say. Last time you clipped it when I squeaked. Okay, bench. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, okay. Well, 
All right. This is a special stream, by the way. Um, I don't usually stream on Thursdays. Usually I stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday. Um, four days a week. Which means I will be streaming tomorrow. Um, but yeah, let's... Let's go. You'll never be the same after Nail Sage. Skill issue. That's all I can say. Skill issue. Um, but yeah. I'll be streaming again tomorrow. And... The next day. I'm gonna be streaming a lot this week. Um... But, yeah. I will be back tomorrow. Probably playing more Hollow Knight. We can look for somebody to raid, sure. Um... I always... I always forget. I always forget to raid. Um, and I will look up that name. What time? So, I usually stream at about, um... I stream at about 3 a, uh, 3, 3 p.m. Eastern time. Um, every other day. Uh, I'm thinking about streaming more, honestly. I'm not a frog! Um, I've been thinking about streaming even more because, because it helps me, you know? It helps me with my, my mental health and my, my memory. It helps me with my memory a lot. Um, so, yeah. Um, but I will set up this raid. Let's see. I, I always forget to raid. Um... You ought to be able to make it there by then. I I would appreciate it. I'd love to see you back. Um, Alright, the raid starts very soon. Uh, just smelly raid. If you have the dance emote, spam that. Um, and yeah. Thank you all so much for coming by. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Server. But it's still insane to me to think that um, we spent an hour just drunk talking on Tuesday. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Hello! Hello, Raiders! Smell, smell Elizabeth! Hello, hello! How are you, Smelly Rain? <laughs>